timer is a fucking lie. Hello. Um. Hello, everyone. Uh. Wait, is that. <laughs> Hi. Hi, everyone. Sorry. Uh, I'm seeing an unfamiliar face, but also not too unfamiliar on my screen right now. Um. Let me, let me bring this down. Holy shit. Let me bring this down. Is this. I have to investigate in a second. Uh, hello, everyone! I hope you guys are all doing well. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Um, let's see if everything works. So, uh, <laughs> there's a bunch of things. Wait. <gasps> Hi! Hello, everyone. Uh, here, let me zoom out so no one is distorted. Um, hello! <laughs> hello, everyone. Uh, so there's a few, there's a few things today that I have to say before we start. Uh, first things first. Uh, I ate something that I'm not sure if uh, it was still good. <laughs> so um, uh, if I if I have to call it a day because I get a stomach ache, ache, ache uh, then <laughs> then I apologize. But that might happen. Uh, but so far it seems to be good. So yeah. Um, second thing, OBS crashed earlier, and so did uh, VTube Studio. So I'm hoping everything is how it's supposed to be. It seems to all be working right now, but uh, I really can't tell you if that's gonna stay this way. So if anything crashes, if the stream stops or whatever, uh, it might just be, or if I break, like if my model breaks, um, all of these things might happen. I don't know. Uh, who could who could possibly say? Uh, but yeah, both these things crashed earlier. I don't I don't know why. I don't know what I did. Uh, it gave me really weird error messages. I might just have a virus. I might just have a Bitcoin miner. Uh, but yeah, I hope everyone. Oh God, I hope everyone's doing well. Um, we're gonna be doing some main story quests today, as uh, you know, as per usual on Sundays, I guess. <laughs> Um, but yeah, uh, let's see who's here. Hello, Wanderer. Congratulations on the first. Uh, hello, Zara. Hello, Nimi. Hello, Raul. Hello, Sethi. Hello, Amethyst. Hello, Yumi. Hello, Slam. I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, the, you. 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 I see you. Um, but yeah, I hope everyone's doing well. I uh, hope everyone has had a nice uh, Sunday. I hope you all uh, told. I hope you all told your mother a happy Mother's Day uh, because I for sure did. Uh, I for sure said a happy Mother's Day to your mom. So uh, you know, uh, you should do the same. If I'm the one, if I'm the one saying that to your mom, uh, you should you should also be saying that to your mom. <laughs> but yeah, um, thank you for the head pad. Wait, let me move down. Let me move down a little bit. Um, but yeah, and uh, so. Um, also, yeah, you better say it to me as well. You better say it to me too. Uh, but yeah, I hope everyone's doing doing well on this day. Um, yeah, let's see. Uh, hello, Devila. Hello, Devila, and hello, Sethi. Uh, hope you guys. Hope you guys are having a chill Sunday. I'm drawing because internet's being spotty. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. I uh, I don't know. I was struggling a little bit with the internet the other day, but it seems to be fine now. I don't know. Some things are just breaking, and then also the bot, as you could tell in the streams yesterday or whatever, right? The, well, the stream yesterday. Uh, my bot is kind of being mean to me and being delayed and whatever, so there might some there might be some technical issues. But, you know, that's nothing new. When When is there ever no technical issues, you know? But yeah. Um, Mother's Day was in March in the UK, I know. It's just, uh, for us, it is today. Uh, so in Germany it is today, uh, it's probably in some other countries, uh, like near, near here, like in the Netherlands, or I don't know, there's people in here who could probably tell me about that, uh, but yeah, um, so that, we're, we're celebrating it today, I don't know. <laughs> it's kind of weird that that's like on different days, right? It just doesn't make sense to me, and I always get confused, but yeah. Um, hello, Starbull. Yes, thank you for the lurk. Thank you, Starbull. I appreciate it. I appreciate you being here, despite spoilers. Uh, don't mind the sky. Everything is fine. Uh, we're still in the middle of the apocalypse. Um, <laughs> we're still in the middle of the apocalypse. Um, but yeah, it's it's gonna be okay. Uh, we have an axe model here. There's a... There's an axe model here. Um, but yeah. Uh, we're gonna see what awaits us today. I literally, I don't know. I don't know where we left off. No, I don't- I do know where we left off. I see Graha standing here in the back and the other signs, but you know, you know. Uh, 
<laughs> but uh, yeah, I, I see that and uh, I don't know, we kind of, we kind of left off where uh, the dragon said, oh, you know, uh, this is, I'm actually the, uh, the, the leader of your city or whatever, and, uh, you know, all of that good stuff, so, uh, we're gonna see how that continues today. Um, someone said another good, s uh, point to stop actually is coming up, so this might just be a little bit of downtime before everything gets terrible again. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised, that kind of seems logical. Uh, because last stream we kind of had this whole thing going on where people died <laughs> and uh, so yeah that would be cool if they just you know if they chilled a little bit uh, for the time being I mean I'm all for like action or whatever but uh, it's nice that we get a little bit of time to recover <laughs> so yeah um, let's see uh, when is Father's Day in Germany I legitimately I don't know I don't even know what Mother's Day is. I just know because people are like, "Oh, Mother's Day co is coming up, right?" That's all. That's just that. That is how I know. I literally, I could not give you any dates. I, I couldn't. I literally do not know what is going on in the world. Honestly, it's uh, yeah. I know like I know when Christmas is, and I kind of know when like Easter is, but like everything else is kind of like not. You know, not really in my brain. I can't really retain that information because I'm just like, it's not relevant. <laughs> it's not relevant. Yeah, I don't know. Thank you for the lurk, Devola. Thank you. Oh god, Graha. Shut up, Blaze. Shut up, I'll time you out. Um, yeah. And, and hello, Ryuji. Hello, hello. No love for fathers? No. No. Uh-uh. Uh, Mother's Day here was on the first Sunday of May. Last Sunday was Mother's Day. Oh. Wasn't it May 26th? Uh, I don't know, is it? I really don't know. But you're probably right, Arian. You're probably right. I, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I, again, I'm like, <laughs> really not familiar with these dates, so... Uh, don't ask me that. I don't know anything. I don't know anything about dates or my country or any any of that good stuff. <laughs> um, I only remember when it's not the UK ones as I get a stupid amount of emails. Actually, yeah, you're right. That That is also how I know. Probably. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not really- I'm not really on any normie websites that tell you. So I don't really get any newsletters or- but I- I can't- like, I think for Christmas at least I get some- At least from like cosplay sites, I get like emails saying, Oh, we have a- we have a Easter sale or we have a Christmas sale for cosplays, so go- go buy some cosplays. And I'm like, oh yeah, okay, sure. <laughs> sure. Um... I don't have a father, I have one, but he went to buy cigarettes. No, that's sad. That's is that you, son? <gasps> is this a reunion? Are we are we witnessing a reunion right now? I'll uh here. I'll make it uh I'll make it uh I'll make it emotional. Uh cue cue some emotional music, except I won't look it's but you you are new here. You're usually not here. You're not new to the and you've talked before in the stream. I can tell I can tell that. But you haven't been here before. And you brought him here, didn't you? How dare you? Um, let's see, so let's do let's give you some Let's give you some music. If it's too loud or too quiet, please let me know. As always, you know, you can always tell me when something is too loud or too quiet, please. Uh streamers will literally love you for tell you telling them. Uh, you know, when something is too quiet or like any audio levels are off. Uh, because no one ever does that. Everyone always accepts how it is, but actually if there's anything you notice, please let, let us know. Let me know. Let us know. Um, you went clubbing with him? I know! I know him! I know him! I know you said he's like from the, from the family FC, right? I remember him. I also remember the other cat boy. I do remember y'all, but like, I, I didn't think they would show up here. I'm scared. You're so hostile for new people. What do you mean I'm hostile? I'm not hostile. Yeah, I'll even dote him. There you go. I'm not hostile. I'm just scared. I'm just scared people come in here and they have expectations that I'm like this crazy cool streamer. But turns out I'm just like 
really, I don't know, weird. Uh, cringe, you know? Uh, I don't, I don't want to do this. Have fun over there. I want to do it. Come on, I'll, I'll do it everyone before I go. I'll do it everyone before I go. Um... You were clubbing without me? Wait, you're not. You don't go clubbing, Wanderer. Shut the fuck up. You're not. You, you don't. Do you go clubbing? I... Okay. Well, no doubt for you then. You don't go clubbing. There's no way. Here, you, you get another one. She ditched me too? What the fuck? Don't do that. Don't do that to me. I, I didn't ditch anyone. I don't even go clubbing to go clubbing. You know what I go clubbing for? To look at people's glams. And then I- thank you. And then I stop- and then I- and then I just like- I stand there and I stare, okay? That's what I do. I don't actually party and I would certainly not get drunk with anyone or do any of that funny stuff. So I'm not- e I'm not fun to go with. I think you're expecting like some crazy party or something. <laughs> But I literally just stand there analyzing people's glams, okay? That's what I do that for. Alright. Um. FC doesn't stand for free company, it stands. It means family, community. Aww. Aww. Also, hello, hello, Legend of Brocky. How are you doing? How is it going? Um. Ew, going clubbing. Shut up, Ryuji. He, Ryuji literally RP'd when we went to the club. Ryuji was there with us and he literally started RPing. So shut the fuck up, Ryuji. Come on. Don't don't pretend like you don't like it. Um I I go if I know I could because I was working this weekend. Aw. Well, I'll do it. Okay, how about this? Next time we go to a club, we will fucking infiltrate that club, okay? I'll p I'll post in the link shell chat. And I'll be like, yo, y'all wanna like go there with like special glams and like fuck the place up? And then we're gonna do that, okay? Okay, we can do that. Who actually RPs? Uh, everyone? Kind of? I'll get you. Last time you were in your underwear with a cute hero twink? What? <laughs> what? Wait, what is happening? Oh, we have a bunch of elephants here, I see. Oh god, this is getting cursed as fuck. We were just started up here. I was shamed by Sakai for not having the RP tag. Yeah, but, you know, you that's just for you to fit in, right? So, yeah. Anyway, let's see what the Radiant... Clubbing aside, this is not- we're not clubbing right now, okay? I know- I know that's a big part of the game. I know people are very interested in that. But we're gonna do a quest called At World's End, and I expect the worst. I literally- I expect everything to go down now. Uh, so yeah, no- no more clubbing. Guys, if you wanna have the fun talk, go to someone else. We're just gonna fucking- uh, we're just gonna- we're just gonna- Suffer today, okay? We're we're gonna we're gonna suffer and we're gonna we're gonna cry together, okay? And and that's that's the extent of, you know, of the of the stream today. And uh, I hope you guys are ready. Uh, I left the uh, sticky note thing on for you. Uh, let's see how that goes. Uh, I also changed permission. Well, permissions. What's the now? What's the right word? Uh, I changed like the number of how many sticky notes there can be. Uh, it's like two per person now, two or one per person, I don't remember. Uh, and then six total, and then you have a cooldown of I think 10 minutes, so no one can spam it. Uh, so we're gonna see if that is a good setting for that, but yeah. And sound alerts is always are turned off. Wait, actually, I need to check if I have my, uh, if I have to bot tell it, tell that, telling that to people, because I don't think I do. So let me just go to my page and, uh, Turn that timer on real quick so people know that sound alerts are turned off because we're doing story and we're chilling. Oh god, what is this? Why is this already a thing, huh? Why? I'll hydrate and then I'll do that. Fine. Why are you so mean to me? Why are you so mean to me, Ryuji, huh? What is B.O.B.? Yumi, what is B.O.B., huh? 
That's who you left me for? Wait, who did I leave you for? You mean, you mean the Ellison? Hell yeah! Dude, Ellisons are underrated. Don't be toxic now, come on. Uh, let me do the, do, let me do the thing for Ryuji real quick. Let me, let me put, what color do you want the text to be in, Ryuji? What color do you want my te the text to be in? I can do every color. Except, I don't know. Bright yellow, because that's just not gonna show up. I don't work next- <laughs> I don't work next weekend so we can infiltrate some club. You- we better. We better do. I expect all of the signs and the world- all of the signs to be dead by next week and the world to have exploded by next week, so I can use some clubbing. Uh, B- uh, B-Y-O-B. Bring your own booze. Oh shit, dude. That's like- what the fuck? That's like young people speaking. That's like young people- a young people thingy. I want to be blue, okay. That's like young people things. Uh, zero brain cells, right? Uh, how do I zero? We're gonna start this, this, the, the, the brain. This looks ugly. Oh shit. Brain. Fuck. I usually don't drink anyway, so I'm like, ah, oh, this looks super scuffed, but I like it. Ba 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 ba. Ba ba ma ba ma. Perfect, wonderful, looks really pretty. Let me just fix this B. <laughs> Did you guys see that video? By the way, since I'm since we're not doing anything right now, anyway. Did you guys see that video of Amber Heard saying her dog stepped on a bee? Because that fucking shit made me laugh so much and I don't even... I can't even put into words. It's like a... I don't know if she actually said that or if that is cut. I think she actually said that but then they cut it. So the lawyer says, uh, objection relevance right after and i don't know if that actually happened this way because if it did my fucking god i'm gonna fucking cry if that's actually what happened uh is it is this the one where did i just save it oh i think i know okay let me just get this and it was so f it was so fucking funny i cannot put into words how funny I thought that was, like, I, I don't know, it's just, it, it's, it's so dumb, it's, it's really dumb, okay, there it is, uh, let me put that in here, and then we do download, and then we go here, I got you, just a second, just a second, where the fuck is it? That's not what I wanted. Hello? Rename. Um. And then I go here. Where we at? Where we at? Here. Okay, I got you. Here. I got it. Here you go. Oh shit! No, wait. I'm also very small right now. Don't mind that. Don't mind me being really small, okay? It happens. No, no small, no small shaming, please. Fuck! Are we good? Okay, I'm back. Hello, Lulu! How are you doing? People on TikTok meme that dude, there's no way she just said that like that. There's no way that was an actual thing happening. Like, it's so... Why? It's just so why? It's, she, it's like the face she made. I can't. It's okay. It's fine. Don't worry about it. 
Let's see. Um, part of my keyboard just stopped working today. I had to order a new one. What? That's so sad, though. I hope, uh, I hope your new one is good, though. Alright, let's see. Hello, Gray! Hello, hello, hello! How are you guys doing? Finally admitting it? Wow. You know? I'm, I'm just like, I'm just like your class clown. Don't, don't think I'm admitting to anything. I'm just like, I'm just trying to make you happy, okay? Shut up. Uh, at what's end, the Radiant House soldier has a message for the signs of the seventh dawn. Cool. Greetings, honored signs of the seventh dawn. And, you know, all the, all the people here. Did, is he really doing the thing where he has two different ultimate weapons? Is that really what I'm looking at right now? Two different ultimate weapons? How dare you? Greetings, honored signs of the seventh dawn. I have a message from this His Excellency the Satrap. Brave science. Blah, 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 Fuck, blah, blah, I didn't read blah, that. Ah, uh, where is it? Brave science, you have my gratitude for aiding my people in this most trying of times. Thank you so much for the for the follow, Legend of Brokey. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Enjoy your follow emotes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, she was describing events that happened in the week the lawyer asked her about, and one of the things was that her dog stepped on a bee. That's actually so sad. <laughs> That's so sad that she brings that. I mean, it's also, I mean, it's also sad that the dog stepped on a bee, but like, that she brings that up is just so weird to me. Right? I would too. I just think it's. I just think it's funny. And then the the funniest thing about this is is that he has the most dark, edgy looking armor and then these two very glowy, very, very glowy uh weapons, right? Yeah. How do I how do I delete messages on Twitch chat? You can't. I'm also taking a screenshot of that and saving it to my uh to my blackmail photo folder. I got you. Uh, a last matter, here, Megaduta, prevent me from meeting you all in person. As a token of my appreciation, I have arranged for a feast to be held in your honor. May it nourish you in preparation for the trials ahead. Such are the words of Master Vidra. Vidra, Vidra, Vithra. The feast he speaks of awaits you at Merid Merides, Merid Merides, Mayhain. Pray make your way where, where, there whenever your business here is done. We thank you for your kindness, indeed. I was hoping we might find a place to discuss our next course of action, and that seems an ideal venue. Ah, and you t to you, Sake Kuzukari, there is someone we had hoped to introduce to you in particular. While I'm loath to detain you further, might you spare a moment of your time? A personal invitation, knowing full well your services are in the highest demand right now, this must be important. Worry not, we'll save some food for you, so take all the time you need. Hello, there's more people. Thank you, friend. Whenever you're ready, please join me in the Aetherite Plaza. I shall go shall go on ahead. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Hello! Here, take your head pet. Lala Falcon's a head pet. Yep. Wow! <gasps> yes, indeed, a head pet. Alright, let's see. Uh Aetherite Plaza, okay. We're gonna be fine. I think this is gonna be chill, you know? They're, they're inviting us to a feast. They're inviting us to chill. I think we're gonna just be chilling today. I think story is gonna be fine. Hello! Another one. Another one. Right. Hog. Bum, 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 bum. I like how we're having a dinner while the world is literally ending. Also, what the fuck is up with this guy? Why do you look so intense? Also, why does he have tail armor but doesn't even have a tail? Huh? What is this? Access to the etheroid you see there has been restricted to a select few ever since the tower first appeared. We sincerely apologize for the inconvenience, but it was deemed too dangerous to permit the free movement of visitors at a time of emergency, a risk we could not take. In light of recent developments, however, the satrap has decided to su that such restrictions would only hinder our effort to combat the final days. As such, I would encourage you to tune- I did that days ago, my dude. I would encourage you to tune to the etherite uh, before proceeding along the corridor. 
I did that. Um, hello, Flamer. Zero brain cells. That explains why you're trapped in robes. My god, don't get me started on that. Please. Please. 1v1 me in League if you want to say shit like that, okay? <laughs> Dude, I don't want to talk about League either, though. Let's not. I. <sighs> Let's just say people don't know how to play the game, okay? That's that's what that, that's what I that's what I experienced today. Ah, you must be wondering what this place is. You stand in a hall of the Radiant Host, from where our leadership oversees all of Ratsat Han's military operations. Sundrop, our destination, lies just ahead. Did I want your armor? Give me your tail armor. Armor. Me neither. You mean you don't know how to play the game, or because I also don't know how to play the game, but no. Oh shit! Oh god, what is this music? Welcome to the sun drop. Without further ado, allow me to introduce you to... Oh ho, so you're the famous Sakai Kuzakari, eh? I knew it the moment you stepped through the door. You have the look of one who's walked through hell. I mean, not yet. Sherabath, please. You are speaking to the satrap's honored guest and the savior of our people. Can you not show a modicum of respect? What disrespect in there in paying a fellow warrior a compliment? We're all friends here, or will be soon enough. More formally then, for the benefit of my countrymen, it is a pleasure to have you with us, O great champion of Eorzea, sign of the seventh dawn, warrior of light, and all around good egg. Did she just call me an egg? I'm sure. Nice eyes. She just called me a fucking egg. Is it? Is it because my hair? Is it because I look? Is it because the colors? Uh, what is this place? Who are you? This talk of eggs reminds me I'm late for dinner. This one. This one. I need to have a dinner with Graha. Ah ha ha! A woman after my own heart. I like that. Don't you worry, I'll keep it short. There's just a thing or two we'd like you to remember. First of all, about the room you're standing in now. Radzat Han welcomes delegates from other lands to oversee trade with and diplomatic dealings. Then there are military matters to discuss, which is why all these officers are stationed here in Sundrop. I imagine you're more than familiar with each of the nations they represent. Yes, Ishgard! Doma! We've got the representatives from Doma. Alamigo, Ulda and Alamigo. Ishgard, Maelstrom, Limsa Limsa. Damn. Gridania. And last, but never let it be said least, Ishgard. They're, in, they're the eyes, ears, and mouths that bridge the distance between Razad Han and their respective homelands. Aww. We've used this brief respite to share the details of our plight with our pl of our plight with our overseas counterparts. And wouldn't you know it, all of their leaders requested a few words from you specifically. You're a woman in high demand, eh? And so, would you mind regaling us with your own account? Indulge us before you indulge yourself. Sure. Why not? Why is the music so... Why is the music so intense for this meeting, though? I thank you for the report. The conditions under which men are turned to beasts, the etheric anomalies you have observed, you have given us much to consider. It is concerning that the first transformation apparently occurred before the disguise turned red. This is contrary to what one, believe, what one would expect. Thankfully, the information you conveyed to Lucia upon your return from the moon has already proved inval in invaluable. As soon as reports of the calamity here in Thafir reached the grand company of the Orzea and our Far Eastern allies, our leaders knew at once that the final days were indeed upon us. They began taking steps to assess the extent of the phenomenon spread. Our agents were, agents were able to confirm that, for the time being, the skies burn only over the bounty, including this island and Corvus. Alas, that is of little comfort. Aye, at all throughout allied lands, there have been reports of people transforming into hideous beasts. Yes, 
that's not good. From what little we have learned, these incidents are similar in nature to that involving the merchant Calzal. What is this? As was the case there, the victims underwent a change prior to the heavens being set ablaze. And so, while the burning skies have yet to manifest beyond the bounty, the transformations do not appear to be subject to any similar restrictions. If anyone anywhere overcome by despair can turn, then nowhere safe. Rule. I'll do it after the cutscene, okay? That's about the size of it. Speaking of which, we ought to give these creatures a name, don't you think? Here in Ratzat Han, we've taken to calling the first to change, which tend to be the biggest blasphemies. A fitting, as fitting a name as any, to ensure clarity in future communications, we shall urge our comrades to adapt this ter terminology. Do you want me to draw a little orca, maybe, instead of Raul? Our leaders have taken measures to deal with the threat uh, to the best of our abilities. I, each nation has assembled their own groups of elite soldiers to put down these so-called blasphemies and their spawn as and as and when they appear. At the same time, they were doing all in their power to put the people's minds at ease and prevent panic and fear from spreading. That said, brave souls with the strength and fortitude to fell these terrible fiends are not easily found. Just so, and it is for that very reason that we turn to you. Pray lend us your strength and help us to slay the blasphemies that plague our homelands. Now, now, you don't have to give your reply before dinner. I should also mention that each blasphemy seems to possess wildly different characteristics. What works well against one may serve you poorly, poorly against another. So before you go rushing off to save everyone's day, have a word with the de delegates. They'll tell you what to expect. Why is the music so 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 intense? Huh? Nothing is happening. And with that, I do believe our friend here has a feast to attend. Spare a thought for us while you're tucking into all that fine cuisine, eh? You've gained access to the Roll Quest Friendwalker! <gasps> a separate quest line and story is now available for Tang, Mila DPS, Physical Range DPS, Magical Range, D range DPS, and Healer Wars. Okay, I understand why the music is like that now. <laughs> To undertake these quests, speak with any of the delegates in Sundrop and agree to help defeat the blasphemies that plague their respective homelands. <gasps> I see. Okay, all right. The Orca plushie. No, I'll try. I'll try to. I'll try to. Uh, I'll try to draw Orca to the best of my abilities. Would you like that? Would you prefer that? Huh? Would you like that? Or would you rather have me write orcas, things, things? Yes? Okay. Uh, okay. I don't remember what orcas look like. Okay, let's see. Um, let me see. So, it's like... Wait, wait. I, I got this. I got this. Don't worry. I got this. It's like... Uh, so, I need... Uh, I need... Oh my god. How am I supposed to do this? Um... Bum, ba, 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 ba. Wait, no, I'm, I'm really good at this. Trust, trust me. Oh, this is gonna be amazing. Uh, and then you have this, like, curve. Oh god, it kind of looks like a, like a seal. <laughs> kind of looks like a seal. Wait, no, 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 no. I got this. Got this. G just give me a second, okay? And then we have like, we have like this thing here. Ba, 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 ba. Fuck. The the other one I drew is is cuter, but it's fine. It's supposed to be scuffed, Let's right? Let's go! Oh no, what is this? We're not doing anything right now. Go, leave everyone. Whoever just raided, leave. Choose someone else to raid. I don't wanna... I, we're not... I'm, I'm drawing right now. Wait, I need to draw an orca for one of the... One of the mods. Leave. We're not doing any content. Who is it? Who dares? Who dares raid me? Wait, I need to... Wait, 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 wait. Wait, one second. I need to do the, the fin. And then I need to do the face. 
and then it's a little it's a little scuffed. Okay, wait, give me a second. Who's raiding? How dare? Who is it? Pascal CPH, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, welcome in. That was not that was not the proper raid command. How dare you? Uh, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. I hope you're doing well. Uh, I'm currently. You can't see it because I'm not doing my um. I'm not. I don't have my. Uh, I don't capture. I'm not capturing my uh, my desktop. But I'm currently drawing something for someone because uh, we're doing this thing where people can place. Uh, People can place uh, sticky notes on my head and you know, all of that. Um, wait, 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 and and wait, so wait, we're doing. I'm doing that currently. I'm drawing. I'm currently drawing an orca, so don't mind that. Uh, but yeah, I hope you're streaming well. What what were you doing? That is not the correct. Oh wait, we have a we have a correct shout. We have a correct shout out. Uh, what were you doing in Final Fantasy? How did Final Fantasy go? What were you doing? Let me just fix this. So this is that. And then how do I draw the the eye of that thing? Do I just do this? No, that looks fucking dumb. I guess I just won't have an eye. Um Does this work? Okay. I need like white here too. I guess this works. I don't know. This is such a scuffed drawing. <laughs> oh shit, wait. Can we do this? Fuck, I think it looked better before. That's not good. What do I do now? Do you ever like draw something and you have like a sketch and the sketch looks really good and then you try to... And then you try to uh... You know, you try to draw over the sketch and actually like finish or color color in your drawing and then suddenly it looks fucking awful. Because that's me all the time. And I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one. Oh I got it. We're almost done. We're almost done. How do you draw an eye on an orca? I don't understand. It's fine, it doesn't need it. It doesn't need it. Uh, do, okay, do you want me to write something under under it, Raul, though? Do you want? Do you still want like a, like a thing where it says like, Oh, orcas are so cool, whatever. <laughs> Is that it? Did you just reject a raid? Yes, I just rejected the raid. How dare you raid me? I have literally no content. Shut up. I don't- I- I can- I can refuse any raid I want. Um, also thank you for the follow, Pascal. Thank you. Let me see. I was doing some blue mage. Turn 13? What is turn 13? I need to- I need to, like, get some spells on blue mage, but... Yeah, I hope that was fun. Uh, pretty silly sounds good. Pretty silly sounds very good. Also, little Frankie, how are you doing? How are you all doing? If you put it this way, then yes. Okay, what 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 do you want me to write? Do you want me to write orca best animal or oh co binding coils of Bahamut? So is that what you call these? You call the coils of Bahamut? Is that turn thirteen? Do you do you, do you just say turns to that? What you do? Uh, or or cause. Best. Except they're not, because dragons are the best animals. And um, mouths. That looks incredibly scuffed, and I love it. Wait, no, actually, never mind. I need to fix it. We're gonna- we're gonna continue story in a second, okay? I know everyone's like, uh, what are you doing? What the fuck? I don't know if I'll keep this turned on for a story. Fuck! I can't fit it! It's fine, the longer I stall, the longer I'll have with the story, you know? This looks awful, but it's okay. 
Yeah, I'll put a longer I'll put a longer cooldown on sticky notes because they take a long time. And I think I'll turn it off for for a story. Let me see. <laughs> Not right now though, it's fine. Um, who's laughing at me, huh? Uh, I'll put a little I'll put a little equal sign here. And then that that is it. Dude, it actually looks so fucking cute. Who's laughing? Who laughed? It was either you or you. I swear to god, y'all. Um, okay, let me go here. That's not where I wanted to go. Shaking my head. I don't know what I'm doing. Where is it? Where the fuck is it? There it is. It actually looks really cute. I like the music. Music makes me fall asleep. If I didn't have an energy drink here, I would probably be asleep by now. Okay, um, or sticky no. go we open this and then we open that also blaze are you here wait did it not change the name orca sticky note huh There you go. How does this look, huh? Isn't that beautiful? Sloppy. What is Zarek happening? Zarek gifted a tier one sub to Arian. Zarek, stop! They have given twenty nine gift subs stop. in the channel. Stop! Why are you doing this? Where do I put this? Here, this is fine. This is fine. What are you doing? Why would you do this? Thank you, Zark, for the gift that subbed down. <laughs> Thank you to, for the gift that subbed to Arian. Thank you. If I'm butchering his name, let me know, by the way. I don't know how to pronounce that, but... Thank you! How's it going? Good! We're- wait, we're wait, chilling. Wait, wait, this wait, is the wait, calm wait, before wait, the storm. Wait, 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 don't- don't worry. This is the calm before the storm. We're gonna get into the story soon enough. Um... But yeah. He laughed at me. Oh, oh. That's fine, then. Uh, okay, Blaze. Why do you need me to link you to quest? Just look up at World's End. Just go to the Final Fantasy XIV. Just Google Final Fantasy XIV main story quest, okay? And I'm not gonna go there right now because I know if I go there... Here, I'm gonna... I'm even gonna link it to you. And you scroll all the way down, okay? I'm not gonna do that right now. You scroll all the way... No, you scroll all the way down. And then you can see... Which one it is and what happens next. It's so it's such a good website. Why can't you do that? It literally tells you everything. Go look at it. Go look at it. It tells you everything. It tells you when the next dungeon unlock is. It tells you which NPCs to talk to. It tells you what 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 like thingies you get after completing it. Go and look. Dude, uh, it's it's a super good website. And it doesn't help if I link who who messaged me by the way? No, shut up. I don't wanna hear it. Here, I can... What does linking do to you, huh? What does what does linking do for you, huh? Here, I linked it. And now you can still go to the website and look up what, what you want to know. Because I don't know why... I don't know why linking this to you... What, 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 what benefit do you get from that, huh? Huh? You. Um, also, Arion, thank you so much for the follow as well. Thank you. And enjoy enjoy your emotes, both the follower and the, the sub emotes. Thank you so much. Zark, thank you again for the gifted sub. Uh, if you want to do the world quest, I'd say do the caster one first. I literally, I will, I will tell you something right now. I have no casters. Literally none. I have never played a caster in my life. No, that's a lie. I have. I have another characters, but I have no, I have no casters. <laughs> I have a blue mage, yeah, sure, but that doesn't count, right? That doesn't count. I literally have no casters. It's it's kind of sad. Yeah. 
It shows me the whole thing right again. I don't. It's. 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 Shh. Quiet. Quiet. Uh, pray forgive Shirabath her rudeness. What is happening? Get summoner scrub? Wow. Uh, pray forgive Shirabath her rudeness. She can be a bit boisterous at times, but it is simply her nature. Anyway, my apologies for keeping you from your hard-earned rest. We will be rejoining your companions, yes? Do you know the way to the... Mayhane? No. I know rats on hand like the back of my hand. Fellow no caster. See, that's what I'm saying. Casters are... Casters are weird. No, actually, I, I have played I have played Black Mage on an alt. I have played a Black Mage on my alt that looks like Ishtola. Uh, because I wanted to try it out. I always, like, I always level classes on alts. Well, usually, not always, but usually. Uh, that I haven't played yet. Uh, so, I, I have played it up to, I think, level 50, which really isn't high, so I have, but I have played it a little bit. Uh, and I have Red Mage unlocked, and uh, of course I also have Blue Mage, but I don't know. And then I have an, I have, I have an alt that has, uh, Scholar in AD, and hence also has, uh, Summoner in AD, because these apparently level, I don't, I still don't know why they did that, but it's kind of cool that they level, like, if you level Scholar, Summoner levels with it, and same with, you know, same the other way around. So, yeah. Uh, glad to hear you becoming familiar with our fair city. You'll be pleased to hear that all drinks are on the house, so order whatever suits your fancy. And with that, I must return to my post. On behalf of all the radiant host... Of all the radiant host? I thank you and your friends once more for lending your strength and courage to Razad Han in our time of need. We shall endeavor to fight a good fight to the end, that we might honor Iwan's legacy and serve Master Vithra well. You have my word that your efforts will not, will not be in vain. I know Ratsatan like the back of my hand, I guess you could call it. Is that what I read? That's what I read, isn't it? Um, I like how everyone's just chilling here. See, I can't even... Well, I could do it. I, I need to... Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't need to do these right now. We're good. I don't need to do this. Is that... Oh. I, um... What the fuck is... What? It's, uh, chat, it's, uh, say, no, uh, uh, scream chat, no, what is it, shout, shout chat is being weird. Let's see. Black Mage doesn't start, and really start until level 60? Come on, I'm trying here, okay? I'm trying. Uh, welcome. When the satrap asked us to entertain a party of honored guests, I was wondering who it might be. This is a lovely surprise, to say the least. By the way, I hear all about... I hear all about that follow. Thank you, uh, Saf Sora? Is it Saf08? Is that lead speech? Please correct me if I say anything wrong. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in, welcome in. Mm. I appreciate it. Looked at me, Eugene just went, no. I was thinking it was someone else, it's fine, don't worry. By the way, I heard all about Kazel from your friend Grahatia. I- <gasps> Sorry, I understand there's nothing that could be done, but I was heartened to hear he meant us no harm. I cannot thank you for dispatching the beasts. As, a, as, a, as the smallest token of our thanks, your food and drink tonight are Mer Meridi's treat. I don't- I still know. They read this name before, but I still don't know how to say it. Speaking of which, what shall I start you off with? A piping hot mug of chai. A glass of your finest local spills of water. Just water, just water. That's literally me. That is literally me ordering any- Wait, they're sitting here! Wait, they're in the back! Wait, they're sitting in the back! Holy shit, I didn't even notice! Oh my god. As you wish, pray to join your friends and I will bring you your drink. <gasps> How is your meeting with the Radiant? I would love to hear more. I would love to hear more from you. Forgive me for not wanting to make a toast. My throat was utterly parched. Wait, what? I'm overdue for a good meal. Look! Aww, that's so cute! The thread here has been quelled, but our job's only just begun. I know 
I must eat to begin. You better take screenshots of this. If I don't see screenshots of this, I swear to God. Uh, I know I must eat to get, regain my strength, but between you and me, I don't have much of an appetite. Y'all need to take screenshots of that. That's so cool. Welcome back. Whatever did the Radiant want with you, pray tell. Join us? I have to do my main story quest? No. <laughs> Our allies have sent military delegates. That's news to me. Mind sharing the details? See, they're, they're, they're kidnapping me into... To main story. So blasphemies now plague all the realm. It will only get worse if what Father said is true, as it did in Amarot. If that's our model, then shouldn't we expect the effects to grow more severe as it feeds off its own spread? As if people transforming into those monstrosities wasn't bad enough. If the flora and fauna, if the land itself turned against us. No one would survive. Here's your order, friend. My water, thank you. May you find comfort in these dark times. Thank you. Where do we go from here? I don't fucking know. You if tell me. one thing we've learned, fighting blindly and simply reacting to what comes will accomplish nothing. We must find a solution that addresses the fundamental cause. Before our strength is exhausted, before this crisis spirals out of control. Is there something, anything we've overlooked? If there is an answer, Hydaelyn herself will have it. Twas she who bound Zodiac and forestalled the final days. Alas, we have heard naught from her since the Tower of Babel. Whether she cannot or will not speak, I can only speculate. Even the flower she gave us is no more. Oh no! In our time we called it Elpis. You would do well to remember that name. Oh shit! Is that actually becoming relevant so now? So advise the Watcher. Well, what could be the significance of that name? It is entirely unfamiliar to me. Graha will know. Well. He's a nerd. It meant something to the ancients, though. In our time. Most surely. Yet I do not recall a single mention of it in the records of Anida. Another dead end. And quite literally. It's not as if there are any ancients living we could go and ask. Say it, Graha. Be a nerd. Come not on. Not alive as such, but not quite dead. Elidibus. I sealed him in the white orosite of the Crystal Tower back on the first. Contained within that reservoir of ether that maintains it, ether that is returned little by little to the sea, naught may remain of his soul. However, if part of it lingers, we might be able to speak with him there. I know we can no longer make that journey, but you, my friend, Still can. Or the try would be an opportunity to look into the others, in on the others as well. If they're truly, if there's truly no other way, <gasps> worth a try. Are we actually going to talk to the to the, yes. to the others? We can, but act and hope for the best. Probably right. If nothing else, should we learn the first is safe, we'll have that much more reason to keep fighting the good fight. That said, the odds are not in our favor, to say the least. 
which is why we're fortunate to have Uriange up there on the moon, working hard to make all the necessary preparations for our departure, should it come to it. And why we have nothing to lose by staying the course till the last instant. Indeed. To the last, let us all do what we can. I will consult with Master Matoya and see if she knows of a way to reach Hydaelyn from the Ethereal Sea. And I will visit the nation's leaders and attempt to ascertain how far the final days have progressed elsewhere. Keep me abreast of your findings. I can seek out and slay the worst of the immediate threats, only to slow the spread. Unease, terror, despair. Try as we might to suppress them, these emotions will return to harry us time and time again. But when they do, remember this. Your friends and loved ones are out there somewhere, sharing in your struggle. You are not alone. So ends the brief <gasps> respite before the next revelation. Oh no. Oh no, don't say that, Emmett, please. Yes. So much left for you to see. Dude, stop metagaming me, you bitch. Just because you know what happens. beginning ends, <laughs> and end begins. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> oh, no. Don't say that, Emmett. Why would you say something like that? Anyway. <laughs> Anyway, they teleported me. I'm gone. Screenshots have been done. Uh, amazing. Wonderful. Good. Good, 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 good. Also, I'm Yesha. Hello. I hope you're well. I hope you're well. Uh, now, then, is there anything we've forgotten to mention? Are your arms and arm in good order? Also, Lulu. Did I say hi to you, Lulu? I don't know. In that case, it's time we each attended to our tests. God, shut up. And when you arrive on the first, give my regards to Reen. Tell her I miss her. <gasps> oh. Oh shit. Oh shit, it's the lyrics. It's the fucking lyrics from the fucking song. Return to the Crystarium. <gasps> Grahatia has, has something he wishes to give you. Take this, Sake. My spirit. My spirit vessel. Oh god. Oh no. Empty now, of course, but it should allow you to operate the tower systems in the umbilicus. If even the smallest fr fragment of Elidibus's, Elidibus's essence remains, it should be possible to locate it. As for access to the umbilicus, pray seek out Lena for assistance. Chances are still, as chances are she still stands watch at the Accensor Gate. Should she, she or anyone else ask after me, tell them I'm living my life to the fullest and I'm happy hardships and all. Oh my god. Well, we best had be we had best be on our respective ways. God God's willing, we will see each other again ere long. I'm sobbing. I'm sobbing. Don't go, God, don't go. I'm so I'm so sad. There's no way we're just there, we're actually going back. Holy shit. Let's do it. Uh, I didn't take any screenshots, uh, but other people did. Other people did for you. You're fine. It's gonna help with visiting my moms for Mother's Day. Aww. Clearly didn't miss anything. If the good stuff, damn. Damn, are you saying what we did last time wasn't wasn't good? Uh huh? You saying that isn't the good stuff? Can I fly here? Oh, don't look at me. No, don't look at me. I know I should be able to fly here and I'm not. Shh, quiet. Quiet, everyone. I don't want to hear it. I'm suffering more than you. Suffering more than you with this. <laughs> Apparently, a broad chocolate right on time because she was about to run out of her emergency supply of chocolate. Jesus Christ. That's good then. That is good. Is this treasure maps? Yes, this is treasure maps. Damn. That's good though, that's good though. I'm glad you had a good time there. And uh, yeah, you didn't know, you didn't miss much. We didn't really do, do much. Because I had to write some, I had to write some sticky notes, you know? Huh? And then we talked a little bit. Fool around a little bit, you know? Lita! Saka, you're returned.
Have you been well, you and the others? As well as can be, we've no shortage of troubles, but we're well enough. Yes, this one. Then things are much the same for you as they were here. My lord is doubtless enjoying himself. He, he said this to you, these exact words. Oh, to know that he is happy, it fills my heart with joy. Oh, Thank you, Sake, for taking care of him. When next you see him, please tell him not to overexert him exert himself. Futile the request though it is. And tell him that all is well here. The peace you gifted us continues, and we work hard to build new lives for ourselves. In the course of this, we occasionally bicker, but we've never been more optimistic for the morrow. If I had to mention one dilemma, it would be one it would be the question of our governance. Uh, even if even as we speak, debate rages over how we should run the city in the Exarch's absence. Most are of a mind that the settlement council should continue to oversee the general running of the Crystarium, where representatives are elected to determine policy and handle diplomacy. Are they gonna do something like the forum? That would be so funny. Thus, for nothing is set in stone, but ho however we choose to proceed, we will not replace our lord. No one could. I don't know what I'm saying to her. <laughs> Have we recently observed any unusual phenomena? No, I cannot say there have been. Curious that you should ask me this question, though. So, some days ago, Reen came and asked the very same. She was rather unsaddled, in stark contrast to how she cheerful she has been of late. <gasps> oh no. She and other Crystarium youths just hosted a festival, you see. It proved so popular that there are already plans for another celebration, one much bigger than the first. Between her preparations for the festival and the restoration of the empty, which we did, which I did, the empty is restored, she struck me as happy and full of life. So when I saw her in a state of such worry, I couldn't help but feel worried in turn, especially since she wouldn't tell me what troubled her. I dare say she would be more willing to confide in you. May I ask you to broach the subject, subject with her? You wish to enter the umbilicus. Very well. I shall fetch the key at once and take the opportunity to find Reen. Please wait for me in the city, in front of the cabinet of curios curiosity, shall we say. I will be along as soon as I can. <gasps> Interesting. I sat down right on time to see the talking about going to find some elite bussy. I like it. I like it. I'm gonna do that. Uh, yeah, let me just... No, actually, no. I'm, I, I'm saving these 112 gil. I'm saving those. I'm wasting everyone's time but saving saving some gil. You know? I could buy a... I don't know. What can you buy for 112 gil? A healing pot. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, nothing. Literally nothing. There's nothing you can buy for that. Okay, Blaze. Okay, Blaze. Yeah, you can buy your mom 100 with 112 gil. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, I, I see. Okay. No, I'll keep that in mind. You know. I'll give that one to you, but I'll keep it in mind, you know. Yeah. Mm hmm Yep. Uh-huh. Eggs flying? What do you mean flying? No, no flying. No. But eggs, maybe one egg. Could buy 112 boiled eggs. Wait, actually, do they sell for do they sell for one gill? Where the fuck do I have to go? Oh, I remember I, I remember this is like here, right? <sighs> the following event- Oh god, what? The following event cannot be skipped. You may wish to cancel any pending duty finder registrations. Well. Okay. Is this them telling me that 
Several cutscenes were playing the sequence, but not really. Oh no, is this is this one of these now? What is this? What am I looking at? Do my old eyes deceive? Is that truly Saki? I don't know. Who are you? Aww. Ah, it is. Full glad am I to see you. Hail and home, my friend. What a wonderful surprise it is to have you back with us. And at this most opportune time, in case you haven't heard, we're planning to produce a tome chronic chronicling? Chron chronicling? Events from the Flood to the Night's Return. For this project, we intend to draw upon records kept by the world's peoples. Historical and contemporary first-hand accounts will be the centerpiece of the tome, but yours will be the one to crown them all. I've been asked to contribute a chapter on the soul, a subject that is key to understanding much of your endeavors. In the course of developing the spirit vessel, I gain valuable insights into travel beyond the rift, knowledge that will allow me to attest to your existence and deeds. <laughs> okay. There is no end to the questions I would ask you, but if you could indulge me, just one for now. In your quest to restore the night, you faced many a formidable fo foe. Among them, who offered you the greatest struggle? Uh, Titania, Vothri, Hades... This may come as a surprise, but... Who, who would that be? <laughs> what would that be? Uh, who bore the burden of his people, Vothri and his misguided self-righteousness? Uh, to be honest, just gameplay-wise, okay, if we'd speak gameplay-wise, I have to see War 3, but not even because of his trial, because his trial is pretty, pretty, all of these are pretty fine. Um, wait, but wait, like wait, the, wait, 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 just wait, like, wait, wait. like, be uh, it's because of the dungeon that we did in first person. <laughs> that, I know that's not the trial, but that's like literally right before the trial, right? And so I have to say that because I just remember that as being very terrifying and scary. <laughs> but I don't know, all of these are fine. Uh, this is, I don't know, what other trials did we have? I don't know, I don't remember. Uh, also, Rockstar Fire, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, welcome in. Enjoy your follow emotes. Uh, fill in your own head cannon. I'm gonna do Va 3. I'm just gonna do Va 3. Hades was a Hades was a pain because it was sad, but Ah yes, Lord Va 3, former leader of Yomor and the final light warden you cast down, building his paradise on Mount Gold. He proclaimed his existence immaculate and took the name Innocence. Also, wouldn't this make sense from a I'm overthinking this, but wouldn't this make sense from a uh, storytelling perspective, because when we fought Vothri, we were literally full of light and like almost dying, so probably struggling. Your reckoning with him was, without a doubt, a defining moment in history, and we will see that it features prominently in the tome. Also, that was the moment like right after when, when Emmett kidnapped Graha, so... I know you love to talk a year off more. Oh, right, we were also full of Yeah, you're right. At the, uh, at the Hades fight. Uh, I know you love to talk her ear off, Morn, but we really should be on our way. D those documents from you and Morn won't collect themselves. Of course, of course. And afterwards, would you care to join me for tea? I was hoping you might clarify a few points in your treat 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 treatise. What? Till next time, then. Do tell the others to look after themselves. Our overzealous friend in particular. Remind him not to overextort himself again and again till his ears fall off. If that's what it takes for him to take it to heart. No. Mm. So this is just like a little sequence where we meet everyone. <gasps> is that the warrior of darkness? And indeed is. <gasps> oh my god, I forgot she existed. It's her, it's really her. What are you doing here? If you're going to battle, I can give you some medicine. I made it myself. Best not, Riki. You'd only give her a stomach ache. Ache. I can't read that word. Or say it now, say that word. 
Uh, we've come to see Morin to get his advice. One of the guard finally agreed to teach us how to fight, but first we need to choose a fighting style. Well, I know that I want to be a mage, Arkil isn't sure. Magic isn't really my thing, so I, st I was thinking of taking up the axe, or the sword, or maybe the bow. They all seem they seem they all seem all right, but it's hard to decide. So I thought I'd ask more, and he knows about a lot of things. No, no, you can ask me. He isn't here. Oh, oh ho! Why don't why don't you have the warrior of darkness choose for you? What do you think suits Argyle best, axe, sword, or bow? Oh God! <laughs> oh no! What are we gonna damn him? What are we gonna? He doesn't look like a warrior to me, dude. Is dude is way too much of a baby to be a warrior. Um, I don't know. Paladin is probably fine. Did I have a tank yet? What does he? He wanted to be a caster, right? Okay, we're going with sword because then he can like be the tank, and this can be the DPS, and she can be the healer. Amazing. See, I'm 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 thinking about I'm actually like legitimately, you know, putting thoughts into this. My zero brain cells into this. The sword. If you took up the sword, you could be just like Brandon, the warrior of light. See, that's really cool. I love that tale. Let's borrow the book today. It's really popular though. I hope it's still there. Thanks for helping me decide, Warrior of Darkness. I'll start with that style and maybe try something else later on. And when I get really strong, I hope to have a bout with you. Aww. Why can't she be the tank? Because she literally said she wanted to be the healer. Don't try to make me seem like a sexist person, okay? She literally said she wanted to be a healer. You. Don't try to gaslight me. Little Mioni. Yeah, actually it is. I think Mioni actually said that, right? You know, he actually said that about her. Hades is my instant pig here for obvious reasons of his perspective being very understandable. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. In terms of like, you know, how, how much it hurts. Yeah. It being literally a fight of two different opinions where neither is exactly wrong. Yep, true. Mm -hmm. I always see them as Thancred, Yishtola, and Uryazi's shard from the first. That's very interesting. That's a very interesting view on it. Huh. Such fun she's been having basking in the adoration of musty old bookworms and wide-eyed younglings. But does she spare a thought for me? Of course not. Who is it? I waited and waited and waited, but she won't so much as acknowledge the presence of her beautiful branch, even though they're right here. Such a heartless spring, your, our sapling is cold and cruel and heartless. Aww. Hey, oh, I need you. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, we're in for a beating. Oh, God. Oh, faithful Feo, loveliest of branches, how have I missed you? Here, I'll do that. Aww. If you truly missed me, you should have cried for me at the top of your lungs the instant you arrived. To make up for it, you will call me twice the pa you will call with twice the passion next time. Though for there to be a next time, you've some few struggles to overcome. So, my adorable sapling, the world is on the verge of destruction, is it? Haha, <laughs> how do I know this? Joined as we are, spying on you is as simple as sliding down the back of a rainbow. Would that I could aid you in your quest, but the fate of we fey folk is bound to that of the star. Whither it goes, so do too do we follow. Such is our way. The most I could do for you is spare you the pain by gifting you the sweetest of eternal dreams. But if escapes not to your liking, then you must struggle with your fellow mortals. Ah, but there are the ones you were waiting for. I wonder what manner of conclusion awaits at tail's end. You literally, he, she, they literally just came, they literally just came here. And we're like, yo, you're fucked. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> That's all that was. My apologies for the delay. Reen! Sakai, it's so wonderful to see you again. You doubtless have much catching up to do, so I shall leave you to it. I've taken the liberty of unlocking the umbilicus, and you may enter at your leisure.
Thank you. Damn, okay. The yandere fairy. I mean, she's not really yandere, just a little bit, you know? <laughs> just a little bit. Uh, I'm relieved to hear that everyone is well. I have, I've had this feeling, like a pit in my stomach, and I was afraid that something might have happened. Maybe I'm overthinking things, but it's just that. I'm the Oracle of Light, but I've never spoken with Heidelin, never once heard her call. Even so, I've always had this feeling deep inside me, a connection to something immense. These past few days, though, that connection has wavered, as if that immense something was distant, then close, then distant again. And then, the other night, I was jolted awake by the feeling it had been completely severed. Wanting some fresh air, I went to open a window, and to my horror, the sky was ablaze, like during a star shower. Oh shit! But then I blinked, and everything was normal. The next day, no one said a thing. No one else had seen what I had seen. As far as I could tell, nothing was out of the ordinary. I began to wonder if, if, if it was a figment of a half-remembered dream. Sake, what are you not telling me? I have to know, please. It doesn't matter how terrible it is. <laughs> it's pretty terrible. So it's pretty terrible. So I kind of like, I smacked Zodiac really hard and now he's gone. And now that's not good. And now everything's going down and people are dying and literally like being obliterated, ob ob obliterated. And, and they can't, like, their souls are just, like, disappear. It's pretty bad. <laughs> it's pretty fucking bad. It was in my imagination, then. The doomy witness to the Emerald has come again. Ob obliterated. Obliter obliterated is the word. I can't believe it. Like I told you before, all is well here in the first. So don't worry about us. Please, look only to the tr threat before you. We're fine right now, and even if we, if we weren't, we've learned how to survive. Should the final days reach us here as well, you may be assured you, we won't go quietly. No, we'll hold on until you can find a way to save all our worlds. So long as you continue your fight, so too will we, united in purpose beneath the blazing sky. Hello! Is that a little- is that a little reen? Aww. <laughs> Let's see. Hope upon a flower. Reen wears a look of steely resolve. You're headed to the umbilicus to consult with Elidibus, right? I'll do some consulting of my own and speak with Lena. Decide how we might best prepare for the final days. So it's farewell for now, but we'll see each other again. I'm certain of it. Ba, ba, ba. I have to go. Little Lollafell. <laughs> oh god, it's Ryuji. Everyone hide! Look at him. <laughs> mm, this one. Green said, don't worry, Saka. I'm sure that if we sell all these three fishes, everything will be fine. <laughs> Stop! <gasps> Everyone's here. Oh god. Hi! Are you waiting for me to- to, uh... To witness certain doom and pain and suffering? Every time I see people, like... But, like, now you're just following me. This has become a thing, where people just follow me, and now I'm like... Now I'm just like, do I have to... Do I have to- what is this? What is this? Is that what you want me to write on the sticky notes? Hello, Nimi, and hello, King. Uh, is that what you want me to write on a sticky note? Y'all, I swear to god. I swear to god. And uh, before we get invited to certain doom. Sure? No, you need to know. This is a- this is a thing that you do. This is a thing that you have to tell me what you want to be written on the sticky note. It's not- I'm not- I'm not here to decide. You're here. 
Let's see. I wonder who started that. I mean, it's it's kind of it's kind of insane to me how many people like you guys actually. I'm gonna make it pink, okay? It's, is that a good color? I don't know. This is a good color. Or do you want to do you want a special color? It's just crazy to me that you guys have nothing better t t to do, which, like, I appreciate it, but it's, like, crazy to me that you guys actually take the time out of your day, green, that you guys actually take the time out of your day to, to, you know, to follow me, which, again, I appreciate it. But to me, it's just, like, people are literally just hanging out. That's a- that's an ugly why. No, that's an even uglier why. Um... Oh god, how do I do this? Uh... That's a lot of fucking text, how dare you. I can't spell, how- how- why do you think I can do this? Oh my god! I need to do like... I need to do like, um... What's it called? Desktop... Capture for these, so you can see me struggle. But I'd also rather not. Uh, hello Baba Twisted! Uh, how are you doing? Watching streamers cry is worth- oh my god, you're so mean. I know that's- okay, yeah, I realized that's why you're here, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm hmm I was sniping her back in Heaven Sword. Yeah, actually, Blaze was doing that. Blaze was doing that very early. Um, could, okay, I have a fun fact, though. Did you know that I actually didn't want to stream Final Fantasy XIV ever? I was like, I don't want to stream that game because I want to keep it like a private thing. And I, like, I didn't feel like I could make it entertaining. And and I just thought that would be a that would be a dumb game to stream was what I thought, right? And I was like, no one wants to see that. And now I'm like, yeah, it's my main game. And I love this game and I love streaming it. And the community is amazing and people coming in here from the game are amazing. And I could not imagine not streaming it now, right? But that's just funny because, like, imagine I had never started streaming it. How sad would that be? <laughs> that A is fucking ugly. I can't do- I can't do, like, round shapes. I'm struggling so hard. Okay, we're getting there. I'm real- I'm sweating writing this out, okay? But the issue is I'm also writing with my right hand because obviously... Obviously, you know, my mouse is on my right hand. But I'm actually a lefty, so... This is even more difficult. You know, I'm struggling for you guys here. I'm struggling so hard. Okay, this is super like okay, let me let me let me draw something next to this. This is very empty. I got you guys. Um I started Final Fantasy because of you. Uh, that is always I always, like, whenever I hear something like that, I'm so happy because I, I cannot recommend this game enough. And I cannot, like, you, you don't understand how much happiness it brings me to have people, like, tell me, oh, I, I, I started playing Final Fantasy and I'm really enjoying it. And, like, you know, having, having new people in a community is just such a delight and it just, it makes me really happy. So, whenever I see that, I'm like, oh my god. Someone actually plays and likes the game, you know? 
Well, you don't know if they're gonna like it, but... Dude, whoever plays Final Fantasy and doesn't like it, I just have so many questions. Let me just draw another Cherry Blossom and then we're good to go. Dude, I'm putting so much work into these. I need to make them more expensive. If this is what we're doing, I need to make them more expensive. This is the ugliest cherry blast. Okay, we're deleting that. This is the ugliest cherry blast I've ever seen. That's so sad. Okay, we try again. Um, isn't wasting time together fun? That's why I play games with other people, right? To waste time, but together. Actually, yeah, you're right. But I don't see it as waste of time. Everyone who's like, you're wasting your time playing video games. Can we just all collectively agree that that's kind of dumb? Like, if you actually say that and mean it, like, you're actually seriously telling someone who plays video games that they're wasting their time? Like, dude, you're wasting your time going to the gym, or you're wasting your time going to parties drinking, or you're wasting your time literally doing anything in life, because uh, guess what? Nothing fucking matters. We're all gonna die at the end of it, so if, whenever you have fun, like, what does it matter? You know? What the, what the fuck does it matter what I do with my time if I'm having fun, you know? Like, we are, we're all wasting time. Is there anything to do in this world that isn't wasting time? No, because we're all fucking gonna die. Like, come on now. You know? It's like, we're all- we're, we're all in this shitty world together, so like, you know? Okay, I did two cherry blossoms and they look absolutely awful. I put- I put one of these here. Is this good? Yeah, this is good. This works. Let's save it. Go to my my page. Where's my where's my browser, huh? Where's my browser hiding? Let me just go to the let me go to the Oculus so we have nice music. I think that has not had nice music. Does it start a cutscene? Fuck! It starts a cutscene. Never mind. Okay, well, let me just do this on the side. Um, where is this? What is happening? Wait, why is everyone here? What? What the fuck is going on? I swear to fucking god. What is happening now? Oh god, shit is going down. I can already tell. This can end well. Biometric authentication complete. Please state your business. This is dumb. I literally voiced- oh, come on. They stole my idea to, like, voice these- To, like, voice- uh, voice these thingies. These, um... These, uh, th these programs, and now they're doing that. Come on, please. Uh, let me just this, and download, and do that. Um, download, name. Uh, my business. What is my business? Uh, I, I literally forgot what I want. Oh, no, I wanted to talk to Lidibacy. Right. I would like to speak to a little bit. Alright, let me open this. You think do you think they'll do you think the thing will understand if I tell tell it that I wanna talk to a little bit? <laughs> uh put that in here and then we do this and then we Um I'll, uh, I'll put it... I'll put it, I'll put it, I'll put it here. I'll put, I'll put it, I'll put it here. 
There you go. And now I'm very small. There you go. Okay, we can continue. Time spent having fun is not time wasted. This, this, 100% that, uh, yes. We should just bring back glam review. No, I do glam review. I just do glam reviews now. No channel points needed. We just do that now. Mm hmm. People who say playing video games are normally people uh, who sit watching TV and then complain they have no hand eye coordination. This, yeah, again, it's like, what is not a time waste in this world? Literally everything, literally everything is time waste. Technically. Everything and nothing is important. Reinitializing Circus Tower systems. Searching for Elitibus Entity. You can just search like that? Target That's located in subterranean core power accumulator. Projecting image. Oh shit. My home. My friends. No more than a dream. Oh shit, it's green. It <sighs> I can't do green color. I need to do it again. I can't do green color because it chroma keys it out. Why did no one tell me? Y'all have to tell me. I forget that it's green. How dare you? That triggers me. Uh you know what? I'll do something else. I'll do something else for you. It's good. Here, I need to like... I need to like do that differently. But I'll do this, okay? This. I forgot, green is not an acceptable color. Uh, my home, my friends, no more than a dream. And I will take this away from. Can can any mod? Can you mods like <sighs> adjust channel point redeems? You. Why have you awakened me? I need to know. I thanks. no longer sense those places beyond. All Lord Zodiac. You must explain all. So, he has fallen, and my brethren's souls returned to the star. Mm -hmm. The doom we sacrificed so much to prevent is come again. Old burdens now yours to bear. But if this is Van Daniel's design, then I, as Elidibus, have a duty to fulfill. Your unsolicited act has restored to me some few memories of the Convocation. Such knowledge as I have, I will share. <laughs> thank you, I'm sorry. Uh, both? Thank you, because I was told I never say thank you. I do this not for you. I merely perform my duty, as I have ever done. Where to begin? Ah, the end. Your understanding of what caused the final days is consistent with our own. Mm -hmm. The decay first took root where the currents were weakest. Yes, a conclusion drawn by him. Fan Daniel. Not the him of here and now, but as I knew him. Long, long ago. Having shed light upon the phenomenon, he dedicated himself to devising a countermeasure. Were it not for his knowledge of the Celestial, we would never have made the connection, and thence forestalled the final days. And though he inherited that noble soul, how different this last incarnation, so consumed by 
self-loathing and hate. Alpis. Yes, the name is familiar to me. Yet I know it not as a flower, but a place. A testing facility for determining which of our creations were fit to be released into the world. Many worked there, and before joining the Convocation and assuming the title of Fan Daniel, he was their chief. He was Hermes. <gasps> wait, 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 he is Hermes? Okay, all right. All right, okay. That is all I know. Okay, all right. The crystals okay. tell little of the lives the 14 led prior to their induction. Elpis itself would tell even less. An area of ruin has survived. <gasps> oh, God. Wait. I saw you there. In Elpis. Oh, no. No. I did not. But I did. I did. A lingering trace of impossibility. And a truth that fills my heart. My memories remain clouded, I fear. However, they have revealed to me one possible course. You must travel to Elpis, to the time when Hermes served as its chief. What? In glimpsing the Exarch's memories, not only did I make his summoning magic mine own, I also mastered the workings of this tower which, having absorbed my empowered essence, now harbors an abundance of energy. As such, I believe I can deliver you unto the past, unto that place and that precise moment. Given the eons that must be traversed, the gateway will not be fully formed. Your form will be less tangible still than those warriors of light I had summoned. In all likelihood, none will be able to see or hear you. Yet even should you manage to interact with others, you will be unable to affect meaningful change. Also, is that the lemon, the one and only squeezy lemon? Hello. For the reality you wish to save, the reality to which you must return, exists as a result of the final days. But why you do I need to go back? the past to undo the tragedies of the present. Cannot unmake the sorrow and suffering fated to come. In full knowledge of this, will you still entrust your life to your foe and make the journey? Very well. I shall cast you unto the river of time. Let this be my final act. Is this what I think it is? Oh God, is that what I, is this what I think you it is? You must input the commands. I no longer have the authority. First, you must reconfigure the systems that the tower's ether may be channeled for the magic. The preparations are complete. The gateway will soon open. Return at once to the ocular.
All appears to be in order. The ether flows unimpeded. The magic should consume every last mote of my essence. Why are you surprised? Did I not say that this will be my final act? Lord Zodiac is no more. There is nothing for me here. The ones I love and long to see again are waiting in that promised land beyond memory and dream. Now go, warrior of light. Go and do not look back. Well, Heidelin, I take my leave of you. Yours is the mantle of the last of us. May you have the joy of it, the burden and the solitude. It falls to you now. You and your champion to save our star. Oh god. Oh god, I'm so scared. Oh no, I didn't think this was gonna happen. I didn't think this was gonna be the thing that the thing that's gonna happen, the thing that we're gonna do, and the thing that's gonna. I didn't think we were gonna go and. Th Oh god. Oh god. Is it gonna show me how I should fall again? Dude. Usually in these sequences they show me how I should fall died. are bleeding. <gasps> Shit. Shit. This is totally what I think it is. This is totally where I think it is, right? Oh shit. Don't answer these questions, but I'm just I'm just asking myself a question. <laughs> Etherite like device. The device is reminiscent of an etherite. Perhaps it is possible to attune with it. Fog? Oh, so let me just move to the side. Uh, despite attempting to channel and focus your energies, you fail to tune with, with the device. You can only assume it operates differently. What does this say? Incorporeal. Transcending the boundary between existence and ni nihility. Oh god. The man stands dutifully by the etherite-like device, a guide for this facility in all likelihood. He can't hear me. You attempt to get the man's attention, but if he sees or hears you, he gives absolutely no indication. As Elidibus warned, it appears your form is intangible. Hello. This is the right place, yes? Pro- Propyleon? Judging by the woman's words, this facility is called Propyleon. I don't know how to pronounce that, I apologize. You attempt to gently prod the woman to attract her attention but feel nothing, and it seems neither does she. Huh. Um, hello, it's Mew! Hello! I am doing well! Thank you, I hope you're also doing well! 
I hope you are also doing well. Small lizard is small. Uh, smaller than usual, yes. Good. The remarkably large man wears a black robe and a half mask, much like the phantoms you encountered in Mar Lamentorum and the recreated Amarot. It would seem you have made it to your destination. Your, you gesticulate wildly and shout all manner of greetings and obscenities. Wait, what? I would never do that. But the man does not so much as glance in your general direction. You're small as normal? No, I'm not. Shut up. I'm doing well. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Uh, just stop it by saying hi before heading to bed. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I hope you have a good night. If you can chill and, and you know, have a, have a super nice dreams. And, uh, yeah. You're just way smaller than them. Yeah, but like, ugh, come on. You know what I mean. Wait, 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 wait. You know what I mean. Also, Isaac, Isaac, dig. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Enjoy your following mounts. Uh, the sus you suspect the store leads outside, but how to open it? I mean, I can't really interact with things, so I don't know. Oh god, who is it? Who is it? And here we are. Elpis. Oh no. 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 Well, oh no. How rare to receive you in person. Oh no. To what do we owe the honor? Oh no. <gasps> oh, just a few odd tasks. We'll be here a while. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god! to stay as long as you oh see it, of course. Oh my god. As a matter of procedure, however, I must ask that you kindly remove your masks. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Is the other one Emmett? Come on. Come now. Is this truly necessary? Surely you can tell who we are. <laughs> who you are, perhaps. But I am far less infamous. Oh my god! Regardless, if we do not follow protocol, it is our hosts who would be held accountable. So, please, do favor us with your handsome face. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <sighs> my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Satisfied. I thank you for your cooperation. You are free to go about your business. Oh, my God. By the by, you see it too, yes? What? No. Which, no, not us, not us, right? Something else, right? I haven't the foggiest what you're talking about. <laughs> No. Hmm. That's odd. I'm gonna cry. No, I am already crying. There's no way. It's Th right here. A bit thin in the ether, but there's no mistaking it. The color of its soul is almost identical to Azem's. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 
Do you suppose she created it? Rather unusual for a familiar to have a soul, though. Don't ask me. All I know is that it's trouble. Doubly so if it's her spitting image. Leave it be. Come now. Oh my god. Hmm. It's trying to say something. But it's literally too intangible to Oh form my words. god, what is happening? I'm gonna have a heart attack. I'm gonna Why don't have a you give it some ether. Spare a snifter of your bounteous reserves. Who do you take me for? Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna... I'm, Why, I'm a sobbing. dear friend, of course. One who wouldn't let acts of kindness, such as my accompanying him on errands to far-flung outposts, go unrewarded? <sighs> oh my god. I suggest you close your eyes, or this may be unpleasant. He snapped. He fucking snapped. Oh my god! What is happening? Yeah, I was about to say that. You may open your eyes. Am I tall? I'm tall. Oh my god, dude, no, what? Or am I so small? I can't tell. Oh no, we're good. Oh, you even adjusted its size. The better to indulge Oh my god, room. what is this happening? Way, it will be easier to communicate. How very thoughtful of you. And may I applaud your artful reinforcement. Without further ado then. Greetings. I am Hithlidaeus, chief of the Bureau of the Architect. I'm gonna cry. Sulking beside me is the most honorable Emmett Selk of the Convocation of Fourteen. I know. <laughs> I know. And how might we address you, my new friend? A fine name. And I'm pleased to see you understand our words. I fear a lot of fell he says still a bit small. Is that true? Can anyone confirm so that? Tell us, whence have you come? The thinness of your essence suggests you weren't created here. Oh my god, that's so cool. You do not know? Or cannot say. Hmm. Allow me to ask a different question, then. What brings you here? I seek a name- I seek a man named Hermes. Well now, the same as us. Perhaps Azim wished to come too, but had to settle for a familiar. If she truly wished to be here, then she would be. I mean, I am. <laughs> I mean, is it, you know? Gotta... Right, you are. Uh, whatever. Fine. My apologies if we've given offense. The two of us can discern the color of souls, you see. And yours happens to resemble that of a friend. And with your purpose matching our own, besides, we jumped to a hasty conclusion. We are here to speak with Hermes, the chief overseer of this facility, which we also intend to tour in order to gain greater insight into the man's work. We, I say, though this is Emmett Selk's charge. I am here only to serve as his guide. And I should be happy to serve as yours as well. 
by way of an apology for the misunderstanding. I can't believe this is happening right now. <laughs> I can't, I, I'm like, what? <laughs> what is going on? Oh, also no crescent, yes, it's it's indeed Hithlodeus, and it's also Emmet. Wait, are you suggesting that we bring it along on official business? This thing we know next to nothing about? Oh my god, you're so mean. He's still if you a- harbor suspicions, Better to keep it close than leave it to its own devices. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> Can you stop calling me an it? Holy shit. Um, does this still count as Emmett still being a sarcastic bitch? Because, I mean, he narrated it though. So like, he narrates the story though. So like, I, <laughs> I guess it still counts. Besides, having a mysterious life form in tow is the norm rather than the exception here. True, probably, I don't know. Oh my god. What is the- oh god, is this a new area? Welcome, it my friends, to the testing ground of creation at Heaven's Edge. Elpis. Oh, shit. <gasps> it's the axolotls! Finally! Oh my god! <gasps> it's it's Hermes and it's Thingy! Oh my god! Hermes! Visitors! We have visitors! Oh my god, this is happening right now! This is happening! It's happening! It's happening! It's happening! It's happening! Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what secrets are you hiding, I wonder? Can I just stay here? <laughs> Too. <laughs> so, 
because she makes it even funnier. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> that's so cool. Y'all want to take a picture? Y'all want to take a picture with Hippolytus and Emmett Salad? You have to like position yourself so you're like next to them. <laughs> that's so cool. <laughs> oh my god. I'm like, I'm like, I'm gonna like show you where they are. I know you probably, you can't see them. Wait, I also want an axolotl. Where's my axolotl here? That's so cool. <laughs> I don't wanna, I don't wanna leave. I just, I just wanna stay here. Can we just like stay here? Oh shit, we need to like reset some poses though. Can we like reset some poses? Can you like jump up and like sit down, jump up, or do like an emo that we wanna do? Also, why are you so close to Emmett? Huh? <laughs> You're so close to Emmett. Like breathing into his neck. Yeah, if you want like to reset your pose, that would be that would be cool. You'd have to like sit down and then, or like do a new, do a new emote. Oh my god. Yeah, pos. <laughs> D don't stand inside. <laughs> don't stand inside. I don't think he's watching the stream, which is fine. Oh, that works. That works. This is cool. Hey, this is actually really cool. Uh, let's see. Um, oh god. <laughs> You're still doing the fucking- <laughs> Can I, like, reset that? Does that reset? Please tell me that resets. Just tell me that effect- Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> I need to, like- Okay, let's see. And then we do... And then we do... Where do we... Is this good? I don't know where y'all are looking. Uh, wait, let me do... Okay, I need to... <laughs> I need to, like, fix this. It's way too silly. And I hope, like... I wish the axolotls would, like, move in front, but... Uh, let's pause that one. Everyone else is chilling, right? Let's do this. That. How do I like this? I never know where to wait. No, no, no. Do, do it again. Do it again. Like this, and then you need to snip. I got you guys. That works. Look with the feathers. Oh my god, it's so cool. Okay, um... Do I want to do like an ant now? Everyone knows who this is. Okay. All the axolotls at my feet! Look at all the axolotls at my feet! <laughs> That's so cute! Wait, there was another one like right in front, right? Let me just... Okay, let me do... This. <laughs> That's so cool. How do I- how do I get the axolotl in here? Wait. Let's do this. I need the axolotl on the left. Oh god. <laughs> I don't ever want to leave. I- I don't want to leave. I want to stay. I think we're good, right? And think this is if you want to take screenshots, please always take screenshots. We have a cool color filter. And that doesn't ruin our eyes. This one, this one looks kinda nice. No. I don't know. To make it like a really good screenshot, you'd have to have like G-shade, but I'm not gonna not gonna fool around with that. We have to go with the normal settings. Um, limb darkening. This is like a family. Dude, this looks like a family picture. <laughs> I'm so done. I'm already. I'm already so done. I'm already so. <laughs> It's 
fine. It's okay. Everything's okay. <laughs> Everything's alright. Yeah, I think we're good. I don't know. I don't want to fool around with things. This is nice, though. Can I smile? I want to smile. Wait. You smile. That's better. What did I? What did I? No, 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 no. Get, 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 get back. I need to. It's so cool. Make Emmett smile. I don't think it, he is smiling. He is smiling. Look, he's like, he's like smug, smug smiling is what he's doing. This is like a, you know these like family, no, it's like a, it's like a family picture or like a, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it. It's like when you like have a, or, I don't know the word. Because everyone has the same glam, it's so, it's so cool. Apart from me, I'm just like, <laughs> I'm the odd one out. This is cool. Um, let me, come on, go into the middle. Okay, we have to live with this. Barth, I'm sorry, you're missing an arm. Uh, I'm gonna post these in the Discord, of course. And if you're taking pictures, please share them with us as well. We could do like it. Look, we could do this because it's like in the memory. <laughs> this is like this is like one of the this is like one of the like like old pictures where people are like you know. It's like in the old times. <gasps> this is better. Okay, this is good. Okay, good. We got it. Guys, thank you. Thank you for the picture. Stop! <laughs> Stop. Emma! <laughs> I'm so fucking done <laughs> on this game already. I don't want to do this anymore. No. Oh my god. <clears throat> you are the rebellious teen sister, actually, yeah. Thank you, thank you for coming here. Thank you. That was really cool. That is really cool. <laughs> yeah, go, go hunt some monsters or something. <laughs> Back in the old days, yeah, like that, exactly. All right, let's see what they have to say. This is hardly my first time here, but the scenery never fails. I like all the axolotls. But the scenery never fails to take my breath away. Why? It feels as if you could reach out and touch the heavens. Now then, to begin our guided tour, perhaps you already know these things, but for the sake of thoroughness, I shall start with the basics. Using concepts to give shape to ether, creation magics allow us to bring forth anything we desire, be it inanimate objects or living beings. Anyone may conceive the of concepts, but they must all undergo evaluation at the bureau of the architect. As part of that process, living beings and certain arcane entities may be sent here to Alpus for in-depth observation and study. <laughs> a, fa a fascinating facility, isn't it? I dare say you will enjoy touring with it, touring it with us. Cool. Thank you guys. Wait, I'm a I'm a dude. Everyone who's still here. And this is so nice. <laughs> Thank you. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, and you like all change glams too. <laughs> Aaron actually taller than Hith and Emmett, yes. Yeah. Aww. Alright, let's see. Pet Petalauda? Is that how you say that? Don't punch me. Stop it. Pet louder. I don't know. I don't know how to say, how to say that. Hunt. If Ladeus is looking you up and down. Now then, our friend Hermi our friend Hermes, aside from overseeing the facility, he also conducts his own research. Chances are he will be at the main observation hub, so let us seek him out there first. Do I have to like be level 90 to get this robe? As tired as you are. Or maybe I don't. Maybe I don't have to be level 90. As tired as you are, however, you stand out a little too much, our dear Emmett Salk. 
wishes to keep a low profile for his errand, so do you know how to make a rope? The basic concept will do. Do I actually get it right now? No, in that case, I'm at Sauk. No, your whim, your responsibility. You're getting, in t you're getting not another thimble of ether out of me. Ha, <laughs> the way he sk scrims sometimes, you'd think he wasn't a nigh bottomless font of magic. Very well, I shall make the rope, but perhaps you can assist. Come, let us search for the requisite material. Is he gonna actually make a rope for us? I'm gonna fucking cry. I, I'm gonna- I, I'm- I'm not okay. <laughs> I'm not okay. I would wait for the photo. No, no, no. This is- this was fine. This was- this is good. This is really good. It was a nice- it was a nice photo we got. It, I, 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 I felt just like- just the way it was supposed to feel. Yes, these creatures should suffice. Which ones? Oh, someone's pulling something. <laughs> Stop pulling enemies! An etheric rope. I want you to use it to capture, shall we say, two petalo petalodi. There are three species here, I believe. Any two different kinds should serve. Now, I should mention that the strength of the rope is tied, no pun intended, to the strength of its user. As your ether is still thin compared to ours, you'll need to weaken the petalodi first. Good luck. What? So, uh, I just, okay, I, I do it and then I use the rope, okay, I, I, I see how it is, I see how it is, okay. Yeah. Careful, don't kill it. Okay, good. No dying, please. Oh my god, it's tight. Uh. No, stay. Uh, no, it's not in rage. No, don't run from me. <laughs> Yay. This is so cool. You have caught a pe petalodi. Come, come, let us see. There you go. Yeah, so these fine fellows will do nicely. And now for a spot of reversion? What? What did you say? There, it's ready. It's nothing fancy, but then we're trying not to stand out. Try it on for size. You turn living beings into clothing just like that. Won't someone be angry with us for using those creatures? Yeah, won't someone be angry? Oh, it's fine. There's no one around to tell us off. And besides, we can always make more petalodi. They need only a tiny amount of ether. It may take some effort to get the form and composition right, but anyone familiar with the concept should be able to manage. Well, well and good to disguise and educate it, but it won't fool anyone who can see worth a damn. Fair point, but at the very least, it should spare you unwanted attention from casual observers. <laughs> Aww. Emmet Sex speaks, speaks true. Even dressed like us, your unusual nature will be plain to those who think to look. Should someone question your presence, don't make up excuses, much less try to explain what you actually are. No, best to simply say that you are familiar. The question is whose? Ah, of course, Azim's. If you say you belong to her, people will give you the benefit of the doubt for any and all outlandish behavior. <laughs> Are you saying- are you saying Asim is weird, huh? Exploiting our associate's absence. For lack of her presence, absolutely. Were she here, she'd have been the first to propose the idea, and you know it. With that, your story is settled. Let us continue with our errand. 
Oh my god, the name of it too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see you. Oh my god. <clears throat> Wait, I should glam it. I should just glam it. I'll just glam it. Can I glam it here? <gasps> I can! Wait, can I actually? No, I can't, right? Not. It's not a, it's not a thing. Wait, I can? But this is not even a... Huh? This is not even like a zone. It's fine, doesn't matter. It's not even... Is it a sanctuary? It's not even sanctuary, though. It doesn't show me the moon. That's so cool! Can you... Oh, you mean like... Okay, glam plates. Yeah, I realize. Yeah, only plates are restricted. Mm. Right, I remember. Hello, bread. How are you? Brad, don't fucking look! Brad, leave! Brad, leave! Okay, do you want to take another picture? <laughs> Y'all want to take another picture now that I fit in? Dude, how cool does it look too? I think this looks very nice. This looks super cool. Yeah, let me just like... Do this. Everyone here? Everyone want to take a picture? <laughs> another one. This is fine. I don't care. I don't care if anyone says, oh, this is rubs the flow of the stream or whatever. I don't care. We're taking a picture together. Everyone sit down and jump up to reset your pose or sit down or do an emote that you want to do. And we're good. I'm not there. So come here. Come here, Ryuji. I'll wait. What is this, huh? Um... Come here, Yuji. Yeah, you better be here. Don't stand in front of Hifladeus. No, inside of Hifladeus. You better use the other pig. What do you mean you better use the other pig? No cursed bounds. Get the cursed bound out of here. Get the cursed bound. Wait, it's sunlight. This is pretty. This is super pretty. Okay, it, uh, reset your post, boy. If it's gonna show you as as calling your mount. Do do something else. Do something cool. Sit down. Jump up. Something. Why are you why are you behind me like this, huh? You creep. There are you. <laughs> yes, this works. I think this works. Oh shit! It's still in the. Oh god. Oh god. Wait. Normal. And then we do. I like how all the axolotls are around Hithlodeus. <laughs> I like how all the axolotls are just surrounding him or under his robe. That's so funny. Okay, let's see. Uh, can we just like pause all of these? Okay, wait, I need to individually manage this again. Okay, I need to, okay, this doesn't work. Yeah, this is fine. <laughs> It doesn't work with the perspective. Let's see. Let's do this. Uh, this is not. This is not. This is not. It's <laughs> not wish. Wait. Eat the apple, Ryuji. Come on, eat the apple. It actually. You. <laughs> yeah, this is good. You look so mischievous. I like it. Okay, let's see. What do you mean? You better use the other pig. This is also really cool. It's not clipping anymore. Not clipping anymore. Uh, I need to get rid of the the glow here, though. Wait, what am I yeah, doing? Yeah, boy. <laughs> Why am I standing there like an idiot? Oh, because I'm doting. This is cute. This is cute. We're gonna yeah, we're gonna do that. That is a that is a cute pose. We're just gonna keep it that way. Thank you, Brad, for the 30 biddies. Thank you. Brad not leaving? Yeah, Brad, what the fuck are you doing here? This is at 200? Yes. Brad, you need to leave. This is not for you. Avert your eyes, Brad. 
Where the fuck are we all looking? Here. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Lulu, thank you for the 500 biddies. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Wait, what if we... What if we, like, zoom out a little bit? And then have the tree on there? Damn, look at us. I don't like this perspective, though, because it's, like, too... It's too crazy, right? But... I think we can make it work. I love how the axolotl- This is just so funny to me how the axolotls are like around Hithlodeus. Do you want me between Hith and Za- I- If you want, you can do that. I need like a cute pose. Wait, let me like- Let me sit down and jump up. Go. Go. Go, Ryuji, go. I want to look up to Hitler Day. <laughs> this has become a photo shoot. This is like a photo shoot now. Yeah, it's kind of hard for people to tell where they should stand because, you know, obviously you can't see them. That works. Yuji, you can like move forward a little bit here. If you want. Yes. Yes, indeed. Okay, let's pause that one. Man, I need the feathers to be like more in the middle. Oh, the axolotls! They actually look so good. What the fuck? Like all in the middle now. Wait, did I just pause it? Wait, what the fuck is happening? I like the music here. You eat your apple. <laughs> yeah, just like this. This is fine. What if I... Shouldn't Hithlodeus be looking... Oh yeah, okay, good. And then he... Shouldn't he also be looking at me? No, he's just like looking. Just like looking somewhere. He's not interested, which I understand. Look at, look at us. <laughs> look at, look at, look at, look at our, look at our chemistry. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, I like the axolotls forming a circle. Wait, were you doing an emo? Oh yeah, you were. See? This is where I, this is where I forget people are doing emotes. That works. You have to have the axolotl. <laughs> okay, this is enough. This is enough. Got it. We're good. Let me just take one more for good measure. Maybe without the. Can I? Does this? Is this battle effect? What is this? Nothing, right? I can't really. Right. This works. And then I continue. Just for a little bit. Actually, it's not that late. I thought it was way later. I thought it was like, I don't know, 12, 12 a.m. midnight already, but it's not. I'm good, I think. Everyone good? Did everyone get their pictures? I mean, even, I mean, you can still, like, it, you know, it pauses. Go into the middle. I hate this. I hate when I like wanna have people in the middle and then G pose is just like nope. Just gonna go a little bit to the left and a little bit to the right. Okay, that works. <laughs> Hi. Let's see. In search of Hermes, uh, if Ladeus is ready to continue on, if you are, I totally am. If you are ready, let us continue along the path of Anag Ag Anagnorises. The place serves as an observation hub and residence both. Someone there should be able to point us in the direction of Hermes. Let's do it. Let's do it. This is a beautiful place. Holy shit, this is a beautiful place. <laughs> Look at the axolotls. Here we go, we are P-walk to hit Hermes. I like it. 
We RP walk to Hermes. I'll hydrate while we RP walk. That's so cool here, right? There you go. How fucking cool is that, huh? Oh shit, my camera. <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I run ahead! Last one to arrive is a rotten egg! <laughs> Watch them run. No, they're fine. No, don't use mouths! It's so- No, 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 stop it! No! <laughs> no! I'm here first. I'm here first. Stop it! That's so unfair! No! At least I'm not last. I'm not last. Who was last? Does anyone know who was last? <laughs> yes, can I help you? We wish to speak with Chief Hermes. Do you know where we might find him? Well, now by your mask, I assume you are one of the 14. I wasn't aware there was to be a visitation. Between you and us, it's something of a surprise. Your discretion in the matter would be appreciated. I see, I see. My lips are sealed. The chief should be out conducting observations as usual. His focus of late has been aquatic creatures, so I expect you will find him at one of the pools here. The pools, you say. Many thanks, and apologies for disrupting your work. I say, Hithlodeus, well, I've never met Hermes. You know him too well, do you not? That being the case, couldn't you simply, simply find him by his ether? Aye, that I could. As you know, Emmet Sack and I can discern the color of souls. By the same token, we can also see ether quite keenly and from great distances. With this skill, I could readily locate Hermes, but I felt that it would be a waste of an opportunity. We're here to perform an assessment, after all. By searching the ordinary way, we stand to gain insight into Alpis and the man in charge of it. This is as much of your, for your own enjoyment, like as not, but point taken. <laughs> if you're going to accompany us, make yourself useful and help us look for Hermes. According to his profile, he has short, dark hair. So you know, it's because we're in Alpus that we don't have our cowls up. A special exemption due to the need to be aware of dangerous creatures. Elsewhere, we do not exhibit our individuality. It's unseemly. This is all common sense, but I would not assume you possess any. <laughs> you're a bitch, Emmett. You're a bitch. Haha, <laughs> it's, it's a rare treat indeed to be able to search for someone by their appearance, and I thank you for humoring me. Come, let us find our man. Ah, <sighs> Emmett. Why are you so mean to me? <laughs> Why are you so mean to us, huh? What is this? Dude, this place is amazing. I love this. Wait, Zarek, why is your axolotl here? Look, Zarek is standing here and his axolotl is over here. <laughs> what the fuck? It's not right. I want to stay here forever, yo. I never want to leave. This is so nice. Where's the etherite? There. This is so nice. This is such a pretty place. Ooh, look at you, hello. <laughs> what are you doing? Are you flirting? Are you flirting with Yuri, Yuri Dom, huh? Is that what you're doing? <laughs> uh... Oh, you even doted her, damn, something is going on here. Damn, you have fun doing that. <laughs> Alright, let's see. This place is so nice. Yo, can we just like take screenshots here forever? Can we just all do that? It's super nice here. And before like Doom and Gloob arrives, no, actually never mind because this is like the past, right? What am I supposed to do? <gasps> There's a unicorn! There, there, all is well, you've not- This is the white mage unicorn! My, what a curious familiar. I suppose your creator sent you here to learn our ways and perhaps achieve some degree of enlightenment. So, what would you ask of me? 
<gasps> Tell me about yourself. Like most of my colleagues here at Anagnorisis, I'm charged with observing the various creations in our care and assessing their suitability uh, for life on a theorist. It's an enormous responsibility, of course, though the sense of achievement from bringing new species into the world makes it all worthwhile. Yes, and this one is good. What kind of place is this? Agna Anagnorisis is one of the most important facility in Alp Alpis. As it is here that we ascertain the various merits and shortcomings of the various flora and fauna in our care. It derives its name from the ethos at the center of our work, that being the discovery of the creations, that being the discovery of the creations true nature. Only by allowing them to coexist in an environment such as this do they reveal unto us the essence of their being. Damn. Okay, where's my quest though? Where's my quest? Huh? Oh, here. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm scared. I'm scared. Also, Celestia, thank you so much for the for the two months. Thank you. We are here. We are indeed here. Thank you so much for the resub. Uh, your 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 sub alert is gonna this is gonna be there in a second. It's it's always delayed. Yeah, there it is. I don't know why. Well, 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 we well, are well. here. What? We are here? Yes, we are here. Oh no, don't die. <gasps> it's the axolotls! Look at all these axolotls! Oh, Look at look at this one. They have such funny faces! <laughs> oh my god, I love her. Oh here. Have a pet. Have a pet. Head head wings. Head wings for the win. Yo, Hermes! We've come to fuck shit up. But yeah, Celestia, thank you so much for the for the resub. I oh, I do appreciate the support. I hope you're doing well. Huh. You are <gasps> Oh Different. You're different too. Oh you my god, I'm me. gonna cry. <laughs> We're alike. Friends. I want to be. <sighs> Wait. Please. Wait. Aww. Greetings and salutations. Can you hear me? Do not be alarmed. I mean you no harm. I wish only to hear your words, share your feelings, and know your thoughts. May we please be friends? <laughs> May we please be friends? Ah! I see you found him. <laughs> it's Ladeus. It's been a while. Too long, I think. Too long indeed for close collaborators. On this blessed occasion, I bring not only myself, but others who long to speak with you. You are of the Convocation. Emmet Selk at your service. Do I have the honor of addressing Hermes, Chief Overseer of Elpis? You do. You have traveled far for it. Given your facility's purpose, its remote location is something of a necessity. Would that I didn't have to rely upon a guide. Oh, you wound me. Have I not ever been an attentive and helpful friend? But moving along to more agreeable company, this one we chance to... Aww. Well, you certainly have her attention. 
Is she one of yours, Hermes? Her name is Meteon. It means shooting star. Hmm. If I may make an observation, her ether is terribly thin. I fear she might dissipate at any moment. <laughs> Shadowing? I sure hope not. Nor do I believe you've made a submission to the Bureau. I would remember such a concept if you had. I haven't, as you say. I judged it too early. She's a pet project of mine, still undergoing preliminary testing. But rest assured that I will attend in person ere long. Very well. Being an authority on flying life forms, I appreciate that you are exacting in your work. I shall look forward to your submission. If we have finished with the perfunctory chit chat, I would discuss official matters. By my coming, I trust you already anticipate the subject. I have an inkling, yes. Please wait to the main building yonder. Your eyes look so crazy, right? Like, Emma looks insane. And so does... I should join you as soon as I've returned these creatures to their homes. Aww. What's wrong, Hermes? The nemostoma is missing. Oh, no. It's on Hithlidaeus' back. Hmm. I may have found it. Never mind. A creature with the self-same ether as those there, nestled in the boughs of a tree outside the grounds. <laughs> You're saying they can climb with their <laughs> sorry excuses for limbs? <laughs> Yes, the fashion has been to imbue aquatic creatures with the power of flight, ever since the words of Mitron created a sky-swimming fish. The Ambistomas, too, can fly, if only slightly, and they could conceivably climb a tree. Whether they can come down safely, however... Excuse me. Wait, so axolots can fly? Is that what they're saying? Axolots can fly here? I'll help. <laughs> and what are we supposed to do with this lot? Oh my god. In Eorzea? Yeah, of course in Eorzea. May I suggest we split up? I know they can't fly IRL. Come on. If you would be so good as to assist Hermes, Emmett Selk and I shall keep an eye on these adorable creations in the meantime. Oh my god. D there's no way that that is like axolotls, right? Out of all the animals, there's no way it's axolotls. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, you better watch over the axolotls, okay? If I come back here and the axolotls aren't doing well, I swear to God, I will murder all of you. Oh, this is beautiful. <sighs> they imbued them with the power flight. That is so cool. Also, hello, Cloud. Hello. Eyes are the window to the... Wait, eyes are the window to the... So it makes sense for their eyes to be so vibrant. Actually, yeah, you're right. That's a nice way of looking at it. Hmm. They can do whatever they want. Of course they can. That's not what I'm. That's not what I'm saying. You know, I was just surprised. I think it's great that they can fly. <laughs> uh, there it is. Aww. Uh. <laughs> wait. Wait. What happened here? Wait. Wait. Why is Hermes on the tree? Wait, what did he do? What did he do? 
what is going on? <laughs> Your hair sign color seems to change daily. It does. It does. I do. I do almost change it daily. Don't even worry about it. It's it changes so often. Like I, it's you know, it's just it just it's I'm I have a problem. <laughs> I have a problem. Can I take a bath real quick? Go go get on Stinky Ryuji. Go get on Stinky. It seems Hermes and Meteon have found their wi found their quarry, a creature known in this age as an Ambistoma. Yet though it has been safely extricated from the tree, Hermes appears to have found himself in quite the predicament. <laughs> The Amistoma, Hermes, Hermes saw it high up the tree. He climbed up to get it, but it jumped on him, and he slipped. Do you need a hand? Everything, everything is under control, I trust. He's fine. Uh, yes, rest assured, there's nothing new to- this is nothing new to me. I've ended up in far more compromising positions in the course of my work. Now, for your own safety, please stand back. Oh god, what is this going to be? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on. Hermes, are you alright? Quite alright, yes. My apologies for making you worry, Meteon. Both you and, uh... Sake. Sake Kuzakari, you are called an intriguing name, somehow reminiscent of a new creation. Thank you for coming after me. What do you mean, somehow reminiscent, huh? <laughs> As for you, little one, you must be more careful. It's like, no, I don't want to. You may be able to fly, but it doesn't mean you cannot fall and hurt yourself. Oh no, I had forgotten all about its fellows! Oh god. It's fine. I have like a whole squad back there and they're 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 paying attention. Don't worry about it. There's like a whole there's like a whole there's like a there's like a full party. There's like a full party watching them. You're fine. <laughs> Don't worry. Truly, what a relief. I must thank Emetsek and Hithodeus when I return to them, but first, with the distractions out of the way. At she as Chief Overseer of Alpis, permit me to welcome you to our facility. I hope you will enjoy your time here. Aww. Aww. At least you don't change race. Yeah, no, I couldn't do that. I have so much attachment to my character. I like to change the- what is this? I like to, I like to, um, I like to change the hairstyle and the, uh, the, uh, the color and everything, but I don't like to change, I wouldn't like to, because I have an attachment to this character, right? At least to a certain extent. Is that what you want me to put on the post-it? You guys have so weird, re like, your, your requests are weird for the post-its, for the sticky notes. How dare you? Uh, let's see, let me, let me go in here. Um, I'm just gonna make it blue. No, no, uh, no questions asked. Uh, that's not, that's not good. Right. I can't. I think I need to, okay, wait, let me. Oh god, the thinner the pen, the more it's obvious that I can't, can't write. <laughs> Protect. Um, the blue daughter. I love her design. Is that surprising? I don't think so because we both have head wings and I think that is that is like peak design, you know? Da, da, 
That's a, that's the ugliest A I've ever written. should be playable actually that would be so cool but i don't think that would make sense right because she's like a creation she's not like an actual i don't think there's more of her she's like a unique do i like maybe want to put a little wing here that would be cute you know what i'm saying she's not like a um i don't think she's like a, how do i do this like uh There's a wing here, and there's a wing that's wrong. Here. That works. Um, save. Bunny girls, cat girls, lizard girls, over chicken girls. I mean, you know, everyone has their preferences. Uh, let's see, let me just pull this up. Uh, by the way, every sticky notes that I make are literally uh, in my software once I once I make them. So uh, you can like request some, if you know that we have some like the Uwu or Owa ones, you don't have to like write something new. There, there doesn't have to be anything like super new. Uh, you, just, you can just say, oh, I know we have, for example, the Owa one, so I would like that, you know? Um, so I don't have to make a new one every time. Uh, where the fuck is the... <sighs> the... Bum, bum, bum. Download. Open. Uh... Rename. Blue <laughs> daughter sticky now. I also had Meteon because then I can search for it. Meteon. That's not how you spell that. Meteon. The music reminds me of something, but. Uh, wrong one. No, I don't want to log myself. Stop! My pain is unbearable. <laughs> This one. Wait, did it not? Why doesn't it? Why doesn't it let me rename? Blue daughter stick. Everything is scuffed. <laughs> I don't know why it doesn't. That. Uh, maybe I'm just dumb. Maybe I'm just dumb. There we go. I put it here, okay? I put, <laughs> put it here. Here you go. Ah, right, let's see. Ponder, warned, cherish, welcome. Having found the wayward Ambistoma Hermes is the picture of relief. Well, we mustn't keep the others waiting. Let us return to Anagnorisis. I still don't know how to say that. I probably pronounce it wrong. Very, very wrong. That's okay. This is like not a normal sky, is it? No, it probably is. I'm just an idiot. <laughs> I don't know. Mm, let's see. Also, this gives me similar but like better vibes than uh, um, Labyrinthus. It kind of it kind of gives me similar vibes to Labyrinthus. Um. What is happening here? Are you guys RPing or what is happening here? I also like how it looks like some of you just want to eat the axolotls. It's I. <laughs> you do you. You you keep RPing. Have fun. My apologies for the trouble. Owing to your kind assistance, all the embistomas are safe and well. I will present. I will presently send them back to their space. If you would go on ahead to the main building. Upon entering, you will see a table and chairs, a meeting area. We may speak there. Very well. Take care not to let the creatures slip away again. Let's do it. 
I just want to hang out here. <laughs> it's such a pretty place. I love all areas that are, you know, um, nature, naturey, green, when there's like a lot of greenery, you know? I love that. Yep, thank you. Yeah, thank you. What can I get here? Nothing. Okay. Nothing yet. This place looks sad. This appears to be the place. And here is where we part ways. No, please, no. We will be discussing highly sensitive affairs. Only a select few may be privy to such knowledge. And well, that I does am. not include someone who cannot or will not divulge their origins. I can divulge my, my origins. What? Will I have to remove you by force? Don't look at me like that. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I have important things to say to him as well. There are reasons I cannot speak freely. Um, I don't know, both of these. I have important things to say to him as well. Yes, I'm sure your business with Hermes is quite pressing. No, you- You may speak with him to your heart's content after ours is concluded. I do not object to her attendance. Pog, thank you. Hermes, this is highly irregular. Perhaps, but I believe she can be trusted. Meteon would not have taken to her so quickly otherwise. Moreover, the presence of a third party may help me to maintain composure. As you wish, then. Behave yourself. Do you hear? <laughs> I always do. Shut the fuck up. You behave yourself. You turn into... into a big bad boy. Last time I saw you. Yes, daddy! Oh my god. So, it's finally happened. Now. Relax, chat. Stop. I'll put you into jail. Hi. Van Daniel has declared his intention to step down and named you as his preferred successor. Oh, shit. In recognition of your knowledge and your works, the convocation is giving the recommendation due consideration. Yes, mommy. Yeah, you better. You also better wish me a happy Mother's Day. As one who does not know you personally, I am to use my impartial eye to take your measure. And above all else, to ascertain your disposition towards the invitation. I understand that you and Van Daniel are close. He himself was once chief overseer of Elpis after all. I should not be surprised if you knew before anyone else that he wished to relinquish his office. I did. He told me that when he fulfilled his purpose, he wished to pass the torch to me. A torch you seem none too pleased to accept. Are you so averse to serving on the convocation? No, it's not that. For a humble researcher like myself to even be considered is an honor beyond words. No. What troubles me, what I struggle to come to terms with, is the very fact that Van Daniel is stepping down. Does this not mean that he will return to the star? Of his own volition, yes. Like so many others have before him. Return to the star? Does that mean... die? Well now, that's not a word I hear often. Is that what you say here in Elpis? 
Mankind is the life of a Theris. Each of us, a drop of blood flowing through its veins, bearing sustenance. In our finite time upon it, tis our duty to make it a better place. That all who call it home, now and in future, may abide in happiness. To that end, we have dedicated ourselves to the pursuit of enlightened creation. And by our efforts did we transform this once untamed wilderness into the peaceful paradise you enjoy today. To return to the star whence we came is a privilege afforded to we who have so loved and nurtured it. Nice weather. A choice embraced <laughs> by those who have lived their lives to the fullest in service to our world. And when they depart upon this journey, it is beautiful, always. The 14 are no exception. Tis believed no occasion is more felicitous than the fulfillment of one's duty. That is so sad, Our dude. office becomes our lives, and to retire is to return, or so the majority of us hold. Some few have elected to eschew custom. Mayhap you feel Fan Daniel's deeds do not warrant his return. Yet you should know his accomplishments as well as any. During his time, he conceived of countless outstanding concepts. And channeling the wealth of experience he attained here in Elpis, he brought forth many new specimens. I know of all this. I do. It's just... I cannot fathom why someone so great and wise, who could still do so much good, would want to end it all. Oh no, I've made her upset. Forgive me, I know I requested your presence. Might I trouble you to take Meteon outside? A change of scenery would do her good. Jokes on you, we like jail. I, yeah, I'm not surprised. Um, whoops told me to say happy MILF day, but I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> to your mother, yes, say that to your mother. It's Mother's Day, must be the US, it's Mother Day, uh, Mother's Day, I'm UK. It's not US, it's, uh, it's uh, I don't know, it's a few, it's like Germany and a few other countries probably. Also, little turtle, happy mama day, happy mommy day. Convocation members are Japanese salary man. Yes, I'm sorry, Sakai. I didn't want, didn't mean uh, a walk. Perhaps you can go f go for a walk. What are they saying? Forgive me. I will make it up to you. I promise. You better. Most would jump at the chance to serve in a convocation, and yet, don't mind us, my friend. Please tend to meet on. I shall. Oh, <laughs> I shall. I find a door. Hi! Hermes gets sad when he thinks about death. When others are sad, I'm sad too. That's how I am. <laughs> how he made me. But don't worry, I'm fine now. So, why did you come here? You want to learn about Elpis and Herm Her Hermes? Oh, oh, I'll teach you. I can teach you. We could take turns. I tell you something, then you tell me something. Sounds like fun. It will be, it will be. Um, where to start? Ah, yes. Let's talk to Ma Mamnon. He should be near the etherite. I'm not good at explaining, but Mamnon is. So I'll have him explain instead. Etienne is accompanying you. Keep her at your side. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. <gasps> look, guys. Look with me oh look at her little i love that her come on i love that her head wings whenever she walks they like flop up and down 
it's uh, it's wonderful. I love it. <laughs> I love it. And I'm totally biased. Yes, absolutely, 100%. What is this? Hello, puppy horse. How are you doing? Disgusty etherite. Ah, the etherite. Anyone can use it to teleport anywhere. Ma well, maybe not anywhere. Not to the ground or other aisles. For that, I, you need teleporters. Oh, and permission. No. Oh. This is Mamlon. Do you have anything else to talk? No. And what we have? What do we have here? What? Uwu? Uwu, sticky note. I can do that. When you saw us, you said that you're mad at us. Why? Because. Because people have been doing this, and, um... It's, um... Wait, is it Uwu or Uwu? Uwu, okay. Um... I'm not... <laughs> I'm not mad, obviously. Uh... But it was Uwu, right? I keep forgetting. <laughs> here, I got it. I got the Uwu. I'll, uh... I'll, t I'll put it... I'll put it here, okay? There you go. Um, it, uh... <laughs> I'm just mad at you, okay? No, it's like... It makes me... Oh my god, what is happening? What the fuck? Guys, stop doing your stupid treasure maps. What the fuck? Dude, literally the entire... Literally the entire... Data center just came here. Holy shit! Literally, just the entire data center came. Can you stop, guys? I'm scared. Dude, there's so many people. What the fuck? Yeah, I see that it's a hunt train, but holy shit. <laughs> That's so many people. I didn't even know that many people were playing. Please announce how many in group? What the fuck? Okay, anyway. Um. It, it makes me cry every time, okay, Wanderer? That's why. Okay. Um, and trains come from the whole data center. I know, I know, <laughs> I know, but like, you know, this, I've never seen it to this extent. That's crazy. I've never seen that many people. <laughs> uh, let's see. Though you look like a person, you have the horns and scales of a beast. Do I look like a beast to you? I assume you are a familiar like Meet Meteon. Is there something you need? I like how they say that. I like how they say that. What did they say for other? Does anyone remember what they told you? Because that is fucking cool. This is Sakai. Could you teach her about Elpis? Ah, a newly arrived familia, is she? Very well. I should be glad to introduce uh, our fair facility to her. As you know, this it is mankind's duty to make the star a better place. As part of this duty, we employ creation magics to bring forth new life. However, we cannot simply release our works into the world, for it would lead to chaos. No, any and all life forms must undergo extensive testing to determine their fitness to exist. Testing which is conducted here in Alpus. Every candidate is subjected to rigorous study in which we identify their properties, surmise what habitants might be suitable, and speculate as to the effects they may have on the environment and other species. Should it be judged by benef a beneficial addition to the star? Oh my god, it keeps going! Should it be judged a beneficial addition to the star, it will be allowed to take- I just want to do a main story quest, guys! I'm scared! Uh it would be allowed to take its place in the world. The two of you, too, were created in the hope of making the star a better place. Aww. Huh. So heed your masters well and be good, do you hear? We will, Mem Memlon, we will. Thanks for the lesson. What did they say to Lala? You're small ones, what did they say? <laughs> they commented on my ears, really? That's amazing. I know that's why I just want to hear it. I hate you so much. So much hate. You had a turn, now I get a now I get a turn. Alright. Where did you come from? From the Crystarium. From a place far, far away. From a place facing a great thread. Uh from a place far, far away. I don't wanna make her concerned or sad, so we're just gonna you know. Huh, then I probably don't know it. I don't know much about other places. 
But this place is important to you. I can feel it. Well, th th this this place. Like, this place, uh, yeah, whatever. Oh, my power. I haven't told you about it. A creation. Let's find a creation. One not being watched. And I'll explain my power. He has a power? Oh god, now I'm scared. Is this the etheroid thing? Yeah. I have a precious clip downloaded? Fuck you. How dare you. <gasps> Is that the fucking shoe bell? That's the fucking shoe bell! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! So are you telling me... Now we're gonna see what the we're gonna see what happens with this bird, okay? And then we, uh, we can we I can I can uh, t uh, put on my tinfoil head, and then I can make some I can say some things. Spriggans, what are spriggans? These are spriggans. Oh no, we call them or Orei. If there's many, if if it's just one, we say Oreas. Though they're cute, they can be naughty. Sometimes they run off with concept crystals, and Hermes has to run after them. Cool. Um, there's no way, dude. No way. No way. There's no fucking way. Make it so you can't see Chad in, in case the next zone they go to the spoilers. Oh, yeah, I'm not looking at it. Don't worry. I'm not looking at what they post. Don't worry. I'm not looking at that. Uh, but I already know that there's an area called, I think... Should I say that? I think most people here have played Endwalker. I think there's an area called Ultima Thule or something. So even if I saw the name, I've already seen the name of that. Oh, this creation is perfect. But I don't remember seeing it before. Perhaps it's new? Anyway, I'll try reading its mind. That's my power. So she can read minds. There is no thoughts. Head empty. There is no thoughts. You can't read its mind. It has no thoughts. Clearly. <laughs> there's nothing there. Huh. I can't read it. Or oh, maybe there's nothing to read. Actually, me too. Yeah. Same. I resonate with that. Wait. Please wait. I'll try again. With you this time. There's nothing there either. Oh god. There's nothing there either. She's like, no, I can't read it. Oh shit. Greetings, can you hear me? Oh, This is my power. I can read the emotions of those around me and project my emotions to others in return. I am not actually speaking to you in your mind. Rather, you are converting my emotions into words and intention, a process performed subconsciously by intelligent life forms. This ability is vital to my mission, for it allows me to interact with intelligent, be intelligent beings, even should they communicate via unknown languages or other nonverbal means. As a consequence, I am clumsy at speaking. Yet, though I struggle to express myself in this fashion, Hermes wants me to speak uh, as much as possible, for everyone has thoughts and feelings that they may wish to hide. I harbor an affection for you, one that is difficult to define. Aside from the fact that you share common traits with us, your thoughts are complex, prismatic. They draw me in and leave me wanting to know more. Out of respect for your privacy, I will refrain from using my power when speaking with you. Nevertheless, I want you to know that I wish to be your friend. Did you hear me? Huh, <laughs> good. Now it's my turn again. So, what are you good at? Oh shit! Uh, fighting, crafting, gathering, playing. It's a secret. <laughs> oh shit! None of the, <laughs> none of the above. Um, playing, playing Final Fantasy XIV, a critically acclaimed MMORPG. Um, fighting, I guess. ERP. <laughs> oh my god! Stop it. That would be the it's a secret option. Oh, fighting. That must mean you're strong. Hermes, Her Hermes is strong too, but he doesn't like to fight, even when creations fight him. Uh, 
The shoe will just... Oh god, it's actually terrifying. I, I think we might be bothering it. <laughs> Dude, this is 100%. This is 100% Emmett's spirit animal. There's no way. It's 100% his, like, familiar. Oh my god. Elsa Lokestanda, what's, what's with the post-it notes? Uh, people can put post-it notes on my face. <laughs> if, you, if, if people want to post, post it, to put post-it notes on my face, there's like a channel point redeem. Uh, but it takes a bit for me to write those. Uh, I pr I'll probably turn it off for future, uh, future story streams, but... I think it's a neat little feature in itself, but it always... It, Come on! It always like uh, it, it. It takes a bit, so it's gonna take a bit. Take take away from the flow of the uh, of the stream a little bit because I have to write it like live, unless it's it's one that I have already. What the fuck is this? Uh, do you want me to spell it exactly like this? In caps. Weird. I'll put it in caps too, okay? Weird. I like the music. Liz. Zord. Lizard. Lizard. Duh. Duh. Weird lizard. My D's. My D's actually look so bad. You have to fix the tsundere one? No. No. I don't want to. Fuck you. Dumbass. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's open this. I'm getting good at this. I'm getting quick. Getting quick with this. Uh, by the way, the original sticky note um, was not made by me. I just want to make that clear. And I have the credits to the sticky notes in my credits page. So I would highly recommend you check them out because these are not made by me. The only thing that I do is I write or draw whatever on there. It's like a blank sticky note. Um, so I just want to say again, these are not made by me. Um, and the credits, again, please check out the credits for all the stuff that I have. Because, uh, you know, I can't do a lot of the stuff myself. And so, uh, you know, I just want everyone to know that there's amazing artists out there who make the streams possible and whatever by, you know, by, uh, Providing their assets, providing, providing like, you know, all these things, like the, the sticky note. This is, wait, this is a thingy music. This is, um, this is a thingy music. You know what I mean? Sadly, I'd have to, you know what I have to do? I have to like, mirror it before I write it. I have to remember doing that. Um... Because then I can't, I can't mirror it for most of these. Because if I mirror it, it looks like this, right? But we don't want that. Uh, where'd I put it? Here? Here, I'll put it here. Okay. Got you. Thingy music! Yes, thingy music! Um, Charlie and music is what I mean. Charlie and music. Yeah. It's a neat feature. I think it's cool. It's just like taking a little bit away from the story at the moment. So I probably won't have it online. Uh, well, you know, available when we do my story quest. Mm -hmm. But for now, it's fine. Uh, how are you enjoying the story? I'm terrified and sad. And also, uh, this is amazing. And I love it. I, I love this, but I'm also very scared. <laughs> And I don't wanna, I don't ever wanna leave this place. But I know that's not possible. Yeah. These? What do you mean these? Do you mean the D? The D's? These? No, just the D's that I, that I write, that I draw. <laughs> the D's that I draw. Yeah. 
Um, thank you for the head pat. Also, Lil Phantom, how are you doing? Yeah, these nuts. Yeah, these nuts, Crescent, in your face. A couple of weeks and we will be able to proc Savage. I, I want to get into it, yeah. I want to get into it at some point. But I want to take my time with the story and everything, you know? Uh, let's keep going. We're going to see Eu Yuanthi next. She's usually in a small building. One to the west, one on the west row. You. 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 <laughs> I swear to God, you. Uh, what is the? Oh, this is the one that we had. Okay. All right. Let's go to that building. No Wu speech now because all the other things are turned off at the moment, sound effects and everything. Because I don't want it to I don't want it to get too distracting because the story I wanna take the story seriously and uh, you know, not have too many distractions for, for story streams because I actually wanna pay attention and it's actually you know, it's a serious story and you know, all of that. Well, well, if it isn't me, Tion, I see you've brought a friend today. Greetings, Yonthi. I'm, um, an apple. Could you make me an apple? The kind Hermes likes, covered in syrup. I want to share it with sake. Aww. Ah, candied apple. Hermes is certainly partial to them. Partial to them? I don't know English. But you know you can't eat, me, Tion. You weren't made to do so. But, but I like it too. But I like it too. It may seem that way, but it's due to your ability to share others' feelings. You've taken Hermes's likes for your own. In any case, I can't prepare an apple right now, but I'll bring one, bring one for Hermes soon. I promise. I'm sorry, Sake. I wanted to show you my favorite thing. Then I could ask about yours, but I failed. Oh, it's okay. Dude, who chooses say nothing here? Dude, who is like mean to her? I swear to God. Oh, and that's what you like. Yes, yes, I can feel it. The joy and happiness. And it makes me happy too. Thanks for sharing it with me, Sake. Well, we've talked we've walked and talked a lot. Maybe Hermes has finished talking too. Shall we go and see? I like it when my friends are here. <laughs> like this. <laughs> like this. This is what I like. This is what I like. Mm. Only if it's in the days. Oh god. Wow, you're all sitting in the bushes. I see you. You're trying to hide from me, but you're failing utterly. I can sense your ether. I can sense your ether. There you are. I can see the fresh air has done me to good. Sake wanted to learn about you and Elpis, so I taught her about this place, about my power, and about your favorite food. I'm not sure if that last one will be of any use. But I do appreciate you keeping me to on co company. While you were away, I finished speaking with our guests. We're friends? Now, don't get ahead of yourself, Wanderer. You know what I feel? You know how I feel about you? You bitch! Uh, Sog96, thank you so much for the follow. <laughs> welcome in, welcome in. Thank you. Enjoy your follow emotes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, finished. Hardly. You requested time to consider the invitation, so we have no choice but to occupy ourselves in the, with an inspection of your work. My apologies. It has been decided that Emmet Sack and Hithlodeus will accompany me as I tend to my duties. If you wish to learn more, perhaps you would like to come too? I'm, I'm compelled to remind you that she is no way associated to the convocation. We simply chance to meet her at Propyleon. There is no guarantee that the matters we discuss will remain private. I do not mind. To see the joy her presence brings me to on, I cannot imagine our mysterious friend harbors malicious intent. Saka is kind, really, truly. She taught me as much as I taught her. See, Meteon likes me, so I can't be bad. So shut up, Wanderer. Yeah. You're coming, of course, to watch Hermes. You're bound to learn lots and lots. They laughed. I can't. I'm gonna die. Honda Warren Church, welcome. Yeah, well, also we were in a cutscene, but I don't care. 
Lives apart. Composure regained. Hermes is ready to return to his duties. If everyone is ready, there are a few creations I need to check on. First, we shall return to the spot where we found your, our wayward Ambistoma. Have care when you step outside the hub, for, here, for there may be more unruly creatures about. <sighs> yeah, these are the unruly creatures. Look at these unruly creatures. Yeah. Truly hideous, awful, terrifying. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's see. The sky is super pretty. Don't look at my horse's ass. I just want to look at the sky. The sky is super pretty. Where is this? Uh, this here is a new species of Petaloda we recently set loose. It has been doing very well, managing to maintain a stable existence thus far. If it can see its observation period to the end without issue, we shall release it onto the world. Tell me, do you know the difference between living be beings and arcane entities? Thank you for the posture check, Phantom. Uh, it is the presence of a soul, yet the soul isn't something you can choose to have at will. No, it manifests only in those beings whose forms adhere to the laws of creation that can endure on their own. Beings that do not fulfill this requirement, such as those spontaneously born of magic or natural phenomena, do not have souls. No matter how much it might resemble flora or fauna, if it lacks a soul, then it is considered an arcane entity. So you see, it is not for mankind to decide what is living. The, that domain lies beyond our manipulation, and it is hubris to assume otherwise. But come, let us head to the nearby beacon. I have received the report that arcane entities have gathered there. Damn. Is this the night music for this place? It's night currently, right? So I think this is not like an actual... Like, this is... This is a weird place. It looks like it's day, but there's stars. And it's like, you know, like somewhere in between. Hmm. That is very pretty. What time is it? Oh, we're good. We're good. Ah yes, lightning pneuma, pneuma, just as the report said. Although we call the structure a beacon due to its form, it's a, in fact a magical device. By manipulating the balance of elements, it keeps the isle airborne and maintains the climate thereupon. In the course of its operation, it often sees an internal shift towards the, a given element. Right now, that element is lightning, which draws the pneuma here to replenish their ether. Huh, it appears Meteon is busy. Would you care to assist me in her stead and feed the Numa? By using this lightning converger, you can harness ambient lightning and focus it into a ball. A veritable feast for our dazzling friends. Go on, give it a try. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay, wait. <laughs> that what do you want me to do? Oh yeah. Cool. I like how my axe is still there. <laughs> Ooh. Perfectly done, Sake. Look. See how they gather to feed, how they express themselves through their actions de despite their lack of words. Speech is not the sole defining characteristic of a thinking, feeling creature, nor is silence an indication that they do not possess these qualities. Be it a soulless arcane entity such as the Numa or an eph ephemeral, ephemeral life form such as the Petaloda, 
all seek to perpetuate their existence, to survive. Is Meteon an arcane entity? Is Meteon a living being? Uh, I mean, Meteon is a living being. I think we've just established that. <laughs> is, is Meteon an arcane entity? A good question. I can answer it from a theoretical standpoint, but it ultimately falls to the burrow of the architect to pass judgment. Those with exceptional vision, such as Hithlodeus, may be able to ascertain her true nature. But to me, it doesn't matter. She's herself, and that is all I need to know. Oh, you're finished already? I'm sorry, I was in the way. Not to worry, my dear, they miss nothing of note, and we still have plenty of work for them to observe. Next, we will head east to the Morning Dew. I need to speak with some observers there. This makes everything so much worse, you know what I mean? Stop poking me, how dare you. I saw that. You know, I think people, I think people, you know, if you're here and you've been here for a bit, you probably know that I like overthink a lot and I let the story get to me. But like, this makes everything so much worse because then you realize like, they were, this is amazing, right? This is amazing and this is wonderful. And then just seeing how like Emmett Selk and all the other people had to behave, you know, like in our time when it came to, you know, when it came to everything that happens in Shadowbringers or even before that and like before that too, like all these like hundreds, thousands of years or whatever, it just makes it so much, wor so much worse. And how pretty does this look? Excuse me? This is so pretty. Nice. Not. What? Who are you? Maybe Ren? Huh? Who are you? <laughs> why? Why are you petting me? Huh? Ishikawa knew exactly what she was doing when she wrote this. I know. I just hope Amazing, people. Is it not? The Ampelos, one of our newest subjects. I just hope people, you know, cherish this. So. How are we coming along? Oh, it's you! Hello! <laughs> Quickest pattern in the West. Yep. Thank you for the pat. <gasps> it's the flowers! Okay, is this... I have a question, though. Because it's playing the same music as in Trollian slash Labyrinthus, right? Or like Nikatsi, but I don't think- I think that's just a general music this theme to theme. Opus. Those flowers. Opus. Yeah. And I think they have a very similar vibe, like... They have very similar vibes, so I'm like... That was probably on purpose, right? The, there's no way that wasn't on purpose. Entelekis. Like me. They are a product of Elpis, and so named for their birthplace. A happy accident, born of the hands of a former researcher who loved beautiful blossoms. Unique for how they change color, to reflect the emotional state of those nearby. Though be it here or elsewhere, they are seldom seen in any hue save purest white. Reflect the emotional state, you say? By what means do they achieve this? In creation, there exists an energy wholly apart from ether, one driven by emotions. That's what Thingy said. In like manner to how we manipulate ether, this flower is subject to the influence of said energy. While it has no will of its own, it is sensitive to the prevailing emotion in the vicinity, 
and reacts by altering its color and vibrancy. Akasha? Yeah. It is one of the unseen energies defined by Hanish alchemical theory. Though a gross oversimplification, some describe it as an essence influenced by feeling. Akasha, though I'm not familiar with the term, your description suggests it is the self-same energy. Dynamis, we call it. Dynamis? And those entities like the Elpis flower, that have the ability to interact with this energy, converting emotions into tangible phenomena, are Antelekis. That's me! That's me! An Anteleki! That you are, my dear. And no ordinary one at that. But the first, possessed of free will. Wait. A form of energy other than ether? Dynamis? I've never heard of such a thing. Hardly surprising. Dynamis cannot be seen, much less felt. And though its existence has long been theorized, we had no proof until the flower's serendipitous creation. What's more, Dynamis is far weaker than Ether. Under normal circumstances, its effects are drowned out by the latter. On account of which, beings comprised of and reliant upon the Ether, like you and I, are unable to make practical use of Dynamis. Tis a truly esoteric thing, known to but a select few scholars. Intriguing. Then, given the limitations you described, why create Meteon? Our star, Etheris, is especially rich in ether, so much so that its name is derived from it. However, when we consider all energy in existence here and in the vast space beyond, Dynamis may account for as much as 68 0.3%. You could have rounded it up to 69 and you didn't do it. I'm so disappointed. Literally 0 out of 10. Unplayable game. The more abundant form by far. Were we able to control it, we could open the door to limitless possibilities. It is not unlike a gently flowing stream, unable to break through the dam of ether barring its path. But if we could imbue the stream with the vigor of a raging river. It's the same percentage as dark matter? In our universe, really? That's crazy. That's good to know. Uh, not that I have such grand ambitions. Nay, I merely wish to create a being that could traverse the Great Expanse. The relative scarcity of ether beyond the bounds of this star was a concern. And so, I looked to another source of energy by necessity. That being Dynamis. No wonder her ether is so thin. Precisely. Yours is thin too. Like an Entelechi. Like me. So... Are we the same? Entelechis. <laughs> sure, I don't see why it couldn't be one. I have been known to transcend my limits with nothing but determination. If I'm thin, it's because Emmett Sack didn't do a proper job. Oh god. No, we're good. Um, 
Oh god, which one of these? Here, I'm gonna I'm gonna throw some friendly banter at Emma. <laughs> We're actually gonna do that. Well, aren't we ungrateful? <laughs> Mayhap I should revert you to the pathetic, faded thing you were. Wow! Oh my god, Emmett! What the fuck? You're so mean. A deficit of ether alone does not an Antelaki make. It would, however, make it easier for you to interact with Dynamis. And limited though its influence may be, this quality could prove the difference between victory and defeat. You'd do well not to underestimate it. Oh dear. I'd forgotten about the poor fella. You must excuse me a moment while I go and verify a few more things. This is so nice. When does a pain start? <laughs> when does a suffering start? Lives apart. Emmet is a tsundere? I think Emmet is more of a kudera. Ew! Barth! Don't lick me! What the fuck? I see that. Their greatest contribution. Emmet Salk appears to be deep in thought. Not that I or anyone else would be able to make use of it even if we knew, but it irks me to discover that there is an entirely different form of energy, and no one told me. That personal is annoyance aside, Hermes's knowledge is undeniably impressive. Given that there are none among the 14 who specialize in the Celestial, he would be a welcome addition. Assuming he can be persuaded to join, that is, I still can't understand his hesitation. Uh, why did you join the convocation? I don't know. Chowski, thank you for the resub! Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Uh, the alerts are currently, like, uh, very, they're, like, very delayed, and I don't know why. <laughs> but, uh, thank you so much for the resub! It's gonna, like, it's gonna, sh it's gonna read your thing and whatever in a second, so, uh... <laughs> there it is! <laughs> Went! 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 You seem to have some papers stuck to you. Yeah, I do. Hum. Hum. I do, I do indeed. Don't worry about those, we're fine. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry, it's, it's okay. But yeah, thank you so much for the resub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for being here for four months. Thank you. Been busy lately with life. Don't even, don't even like, you know, we all, I think we're all busy with life to a certain extent, so. Um, yeah, thank you for the resub though. I, I'm doing well. I hope you are doing well too, uh, even though you're you know, being busy. I hope it's a good kind of busy. Um, you want more pain? No, I don't. No, we're fine. I, I'm fine. I'm fine. What time is it for you guys? For me, it is 11.48. So almost midnight. Mm -hmm. Yep. So many things of this game are taken from real life. Developers are clever. Yes, 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 yes. I, uh, there's a lot of things in this game that are really, really clever and nice and thought through and everything. Uh, you wish to know why Emmet Selg was chosen for the convocation. I should be glad to share the tale. Ahem, it began when... Not another word. Lest you've forgotten, we've to learn about Hermes. Oh my god, he's... Oh, he's pouting! We're to learn about H Hermes, not me. My misspent youth is not your concern. Wait, what? What now? I want to learn about the convocation. Don't lick me. Wow. Wow. Huh, if you would accompany us, I suppose I should. you should at least know that much. The Convocation of 14 is a governing body that determines myriad policies. Our goal is to ensure that all is right in creation, that our star may know a brighter future. As the name suggests, the council is compromised of 14 offices, each of which is held by an individual chosen for their surpassing abilities. Depending on the office, one is required to either be an authority in a certain field or possess skills that would facil facilitate the performance of their stipulated duties. The former category includes Metron, specialist in aquatic life, Logriff, specialist in terrestrial life, and Husbandry, Halmarud, specialist in fungal and plant life, 
Emeraloth, specialist in medicine and healing, and La Habrea, specialing in creation, specialist in creation magics, who has fought, who has brought forth phantom beings of the highest complexity. As for the latter category, there is Altima, advocate of the arts, Igiorm, the one that we fight with La Habrea, champion of enlightenment and rhetoric, Pashtarot, preserver of discipline and order. Emetzel, Keeper of the Ethereal Realm, or Underworld. <gasps> In the vernacular, Fendaniel, Pursuer of Extant Phenomena. And Azim, Traveler of the World and Counselor to the People. What? Should I be revealing such details to you? Don't be silly. Even children no know this much. And you would do well to remember it well. Oh, shit. Did they just drop everything? <laughs> They literally just dropped everything on us. My apologies for the wait. I have inspected the Ampelos to my satisfaction. All is well with the creature, and I dare say it won't be long ere it is released unto the world. Another creation, however, reportedly isn't faring so well that she ripped this. That is what we shall attend to next. That makes 13, not 14? You mean he only listed 13, not 14? He skipped a little bit? Did he? I mean, yeah. But why? Hmm. I don't want an answer to that, by the way. <laughs> I'm just asking myself. If you would follow me, my friends, we shall return to the main aisle and head north. Let's do it. Twelfth then? Huh? I see. Um, I wonder why, but I mean, we don't, like, I'm pretty sure they're gonna, you know, I'm pretty sure this shit going down, so, <laughs> so we're gonna be fine, we're gonna, we're gonna figure, we're gonna figure everything out, it's gonna be fine, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna learn about all the things going on, can I just stay here forever, I'm just gonna stay here forever, oh Jesus Christ, God. Um, good night, Phantom. Have a good night, have a good night. Sleep well, sleep well. Thank you for hanging out with us. Uh, I understand there's a problem with one of the Charybdis. Yes, that's right. As you know, the Charybdis is based on a sea creature. Owing to adjustments to enhance its affinity to wind, it is capable of flight. The specimens created from the concept would all fly without issue, but a problem arose in subsequent generations. This third generation creature was born with an etheric balance leaning strongly towards water, its aquatic origin reasserting itself, it would seem. The result being its affinity to wind is diminished and it cannot fly. No matter what we try, we can't get it to rise even the slightest bit. For such change to manifest in so few generations, I fear they are too unstable, flawed. With your permission, I will revert the creatures and recommend to the Barrow that the concept be revised. With its etheric balance leaning towards water, the Charybdis would indeed struggle to manipulate wind. Yet it is too early to conclude that it cannot fly. Having failed at first, it may simply have developed the fear. I shall transform and fly with it, helping it to manipulate wind until it finds its wings. Wh what? You needn't go to such lengths. You don't know, uh, but of course not. Transformation is an art in which one manipulates a vast quantity of ether to construct another body around oneself. In practice, this allows one to assume any conceivable form and thereby transcend the limits of one's flesh. Yet convenient though it may be, transforming in the presence of others is considered vainglorious in the extreme, as, un 
and as unseemly as running about robeless. Shameful. Am I to understand you make a habit of this? N nothing of the sort. It's just that when transformed, I can wield the wind and fly. It may seem excessive, but what is our shame next to the life of these creatures? They deserve a chance, and we owe it to them to do all in our power. Be that as it may. Huh. Yes, I believe I have a solution. Emmett Selk, might I, may I trouble you to move that Charybdis away from his fellows, somewhere out of sight? <laughs> He's like, what the fuck do you want from me? Meanwhile, I'd like the rest of you to help me prepare here. What mischief are you scheming? She scheming now. Scheming. No mischief, I assure you. I would, but spare you the need to report to your colleagues that Hermes committed an indiscretion. So have a little faith and run along. I trust you don't mind. Frida, I see you're wearing the correct glam. Yes, indeed. Of course I am. Of course I am. Hello. Emmett Selk is out of sight. Good. Let's speak of the plan. It's a stroke of genius, really. We have Emmett Selk trained to chirp this. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that's my reaction. Don't do it. Aside from being able to fly untransformed, he can readily see ether currents. Wait, he can fly? Wait, what? And with his adept spellcraft, he can also imply suitable wind magics to guide the creature along. While he is indeed capable of all you described, it is not his duty. I am loath to trouble him with it. Don't be. As I mentioned, it would also be for his own sake. With that saddle, let's begin at once. Sakai, I want you to go to Emmett Selk. Tell him that you have a favor to ask. He will be disinclined to cooperate at first, but you mustn't be discouraged. With our friend, the trick is to be unflaggingly persistent. Off you go now, and good luck. With the chat mode and say, oh my god, I have a favor to ask. Oh, dude, no. <laughs> oh god, this is gonna be, this is gonna be terrible. Good night, little baby carrots, and you little baby tsunder axolotl. Good night. Good night, dumbass. Good night, wanderer. Sleep well. I hope you have, I hope you have all the nightmares, wanderer. I hope you have all the nightmares, the little baby carrot. Good night, ERP companion. Aww, that's so cute. The music here—it feels like the music here changes all the time. This, this is also like. This also partially sounds like a, a sea of clouds, right? It sounds like a remix of Sea of Clouds. Yo, Emmett. Well, are you preparations for that scheme? That is clearly not a scheme complete. Oh yeah, alright, I have to. Uh, say. Uh, Emmett, my little baby carrot. I have a favor to ask. Uh, just so you know, literally this is what I'm typing. Here. There you go. Um, we just move this back. Does that work? <laughs> it does work! <laughs> oh no, you don't. I'm not lifting a finger. Uh, I don't know what Hithlidaeus is up to, and I will not be made to know. I refuse. If Hithlidaeus is to be believed, relentless insistence may serve to wear down the ever wary Emmet Selk. Uh, please, Emmet Selk. Ple please. Emmet Selk Ah uh, My little baby carrot Ah uh, Please Help us With this very Important task That only you can fulfill You can Fulfill 
Does that work? <laughs> it does! <laughs> oh my god! This is what I'm saying! No, no, no! You are not foisting this nonsense on me! <laughs> yes, I am! Yes, I am! I'm given to understand you have the power to help the Charybdis, and should be quite willing to do so. If you will be involved, I bet there will be nightmares. Well, I hope I am now. I really hope I am. And so I appeal to your better nature, most benevolent <laughs> Emsek. Call him Please a baby carrot. To fly. Call him a baby carrot. It works, apparently. Or else Hermes will transform. Right now. <laughs> Oh my god, he hates every single one of us, now, and I love now, it. Now, there's no need to go quite that far. Altruism is its own reward, as I'm sure he would agree. Oh, would he now? And who contrived to put me in this position, pray tell? He hates Nothing all so of us. I merely suggested a possible course of action. Come on, don't be like that. Please, Emmett Silk. Please. <laughs> yeah, puppy eyes. That's right. Yes. Keep doing it. I did not come all this way to play nursemaid to your creations. I thank you to remember this favor and let it be the last. Oh my god. Oh God. <laughs> oh, that's why you had the moons, you bitches. I see what you're doing. I will aid it once it is taken to the air. It falls to you to shepherd it skyward. Damn. Well, let's relax and enjoy the spectacle, shall we? Oh shit. Pithlo and Emmett are so married. I can see that. I can totally see that, yeah. Oh shit. That's so cool. You were wondering why Emmett Selk joined the convocation. Truth be told, he wasn't the first choice for the office. I was. On the strength of my ability to see Ether. But I declined the offer. For though my vision is exceptional, I am pedestrian in all other aspects. Worse even, quite abysmal when it comes to manipulating ether, for example. Couldn't transform even if I had a mind to do so. What good is the ability to perceive a problem if one cannot act to address it? Emmett Selk has no such shortcomings. He excels in vision and manipulation both, the latter to an extraordinary degree. If there is a mage more powerful, I do not know of them. Thus did I recommend him for the office in my stead. And I wasn't the only one. Far from it. He's so beautiful. <laughs> Countless others vouched for his skill and character. People the world over, to whom he had previously lent a helping hand. <laughs> oh, how surprised he was. Claimed he hadn't done anything remarkable for anyone. Modest to a fault. He deserved every bit of acclaim he received. Yet he may well have gone unappreciated were it not for a mutual friend. A singular soul who can't help but involve herself in the business of others. Where she walks, excitement is certain to follow. Her antics irritate Emmett Selk to no end. Uh, yeah. But much of his grumbling stems from genuine concern. Aww. When our friend calls, he never fails to answer and lend his talents. And in the course of doing so, he himself came to be recognized and respected by those around him. Huh. They are truly remarkable individuals, and I'm proud to call them friends. To help them realize their dreams. This will be my greatest contribution to our world. And when they have fulfilled their respective purposes, 
so too shall I have fulfilled mine, and together we may return to the star. Look at me, spilling my innermost secrets. I can't seem to help it with you. I can only assume it is due to the color of your soul. I just don't understand how you can be so alike and yet so different. <laughs> well done, my pet. Well done! Ah, yes. I dare say the Charybdis will be fine here on. Why don't you go and signal to Emmett Selk? Let him know that his arduous task is at an end. Here, I can show you what I typed in chat. I type, please Emma tell my little baby carrot, please help with this very important task that only you can fulfill. <laughs> That's what I told him and it worked. So you can type some shit to him and he's gonna listen. Yep. I saw so many people called him Daddy Emmett when I went through this quest and I too followed suit. That's amazing. I, I, that's so funny, like, you know. Uh, so what am I supposed to do? Wait, what is this? Wave! I need to wave to him. Do I need to? Okay, wait, I just need to wave. Right? <laughs> Emmett, you're good. Emerging from his reverie, Emmett Selk notices you and begins to descend with the Charybdis. That was the Shadowbringer CE mount, so you know, now you get how fitting it really is. Yeah, I was thinking, you know. I wonder, I was th I was wondering if they planned that, but they probably did. It's, it's fucking like, it's, it's, it's Final Fantasy XIV, of course they planned it. <sighs> I have no words to express my gratitude. Thanks to you, the Charybdis has learned to fly. And Sakai and I could relax and have a pleasant chat. I'm sure you did. The creature needed some small assistance at first, but soon it was flying more or less on its own. I doubt you will need to repeat the lesson. That was truly impressive. I witnessed it all from afar, the Charybdis flies. Indeed, with this we've proven to, that even a creature with skewed etheric bounds is capable of flight. Though we helped it to achieve this, the Charybdis is a herd animal. They may well aid their struggling kin in like fashion, if and when the need arises. Keeping this in mind, I bid you continue observing them. If that is what you want. But if I may say so, rather than hoping an idealistic possibility come to pass, would it not be simpler to have the concept adjusted? That way we could guarantee that anomalies such as this specimen are never bo born in the first place. These creatures are already here. We will spare no effort in giving them a chance to survive. Okay, what I'm seeing in this quest, I'll be fucking honest with you, I'm getting heavy, especially at the Descendants, I'm getting the vibes that this is supposed to show that the, um, the intensity of Emmett Selk and, like, the other, the other people of the Convocation saying, oh, you're, like, lesser beings to us, right? To, like, people who, like, the, the Sundered people, right? Um, the intensity of that is not, like... You know, there's much more to it, and and I, I think it might be, like, it, this might be a point where they want to show that, how do I put this? That usually they would be like, okay, we need to give, like, like Hermes at least is of the strong opinion that, and this is funny because it's Hermes, right? Um, Hermes is of the opinion that, you know, um... 
every every creature, uh, you know, they're already here, so they had a chance to survive, right? Is what is what he's saying right now, and this is like this is funny, right? This is kind of this is very interesting. So, uh, you know, yeah. Uwu Ingwe birthday? Is it? Is it? Let me say happy birthday. Let me say happy birthday. Oh, Arion is t is here too. <gasps> Damn, and Arian has <laughs> Arian has uh, Majima as his profile picture thing. That's amazing. That is amazing. Any any Majima enjoyers in chat? Damn. Uh, I'm gonna say happy birthday later, and I'm also gonna welcome people. Uh, that's too much to do right now, but if you're here, happy birthday. <laughs> oh yeah, Tim, you're you're still here. Happy birthday. Happy birthday! <laughs> happy, happy birthday. Um, and Arion, yes, amazing. Majima, good. Majima, nice. <laughs> um, let's see, these creatures are already here. We will spare no effort in giving them a chance to survive. I hope you eat lots of cake, Tim. Get lots of presents. As you wish, Chief, as you wish. Ah, this is interesting. This whole interaction. Hermes. I'm fine, don't worry. Well, that concludes all of my present tasks. Let us return to Anagnorisis for now. That hit him, which again, it's it's quite interesting to see their behavior, right? I think it's very interesting. Ah, mm. uh, we are all Emmett. What, Yuji? What are you saying? <laughs> What are you saying? You got a good time to call it a day in a few quests? Yeah, sure, we can do that. Uh, yeah, that would be a good idea. What? Want to apologize for forcing me to help, do you? Save your breath. You didn't force me to do anything. I merely chose the most expeditious way to have done with an Im impediment to our business. The greatest contribution complete. Jesus Christ, Ryuji is so intense. <laughs> ether to ether. Something seems to be weighing on Hermes' mind. I think this is the last one I do. I think this is all downtime, pretty much. Tell me, Sakai, in the course of watching me, have you learned auto value? Uh, everything. Nothing so far. Dynamis. Dynamis seems promising. I'm not sure what I'm looking for, but I don't. Dynamis, dynamis seem promising. Dynamis, you say? Curious that such an obscure phenomenon should be of interest to you. Chief Hermes, what good fortune to find you here. Is something the matter? I'm Eacon, I'm afraid it's done it. The Eacon, sorry. The Eacon, I'm afraid it's done it again. No sooner did we release one for observation than it set upon the nearby Occupete, slaughtering them. Was the creature hungry or somehow provoked? I just had, I just fed them myself, and the Occupetes were keeping a white berth. It is the nature of the Eacon. E e e Eacon. Econ. I think it's Econ, right? The nature of the Econ is that is to blame. Their innate viciousness. Temperament aside, it is an outstanding creation, perfect in form and function. Though it may not be suited for release, I have no doubt that the Bureau will accept its concept for preservation. In any case, there's no point in postponing the inevitable. Doors will revert them all once all once the paperwork is in order. Where is the scene of the incident? I think it's an L, but why would they spell it? Why would they not know? But if it was an L and it's like in front of the sentence, wouldn't it be 
Or do they spell it? Do they spell it like not capital letters? Because capital L would be very. Wouldn't capital L be, you know, capital L? Wouldn't that look different? Just off off the path to the 12 wanderers. As you make your way, you should see it on the left. I don't know if Doris is still there, however. Hermes, wait. If this is part of his work, then I would observe. We follow. Ba -ba -ba -ba. We follow. Wasn't the first word in the sentence? Yeah, but don't they like spell them with capital letters? Is that what they do? Hello. This is beautiful. Occupedes, all was also no capital letters. Mm, I guess so. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'm pronouncing anything wrong as well, like anyway. <laughs> Everything I say is just like me guessing what it is, and and unless like until they say it, and even if they say it, I forget what it's pronounced. Oh my God! What is that? Jesus Christ. That's not good. The lacerations and burns are unmistakable. Uh, Lycon, so it's Lycon, was indeed responsible. But the creature is nowhere to be seen. Doris must have taken it away. The man makes his base at the Twelve Wanderers. I shall go and seek him out there. Emmet Selk and I will search the area for good measure, just to make sure the uh, Lycon. Lycon, 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 Lycon! Did not escape. My thanks. Let us meet at the Twelve, wa at the 12 Wanderers when you have finished. I will go on ahead. Please follow with Sakai. Come, come. It's down this path and over the bridge. In five quests? You mean like full five quest lines or... Five quest lines or literally like five interactions with NPCs because if it's literally five quest lines, I'm not gonna do that. It's already too late to do that. Oh, you're 1217 for me. But I think this is fine. We're wood chilling. Lines? Like interactions with people? It's okay then. Grips! <laughs> what a name, Grips. It's beautiful. When it's night here, it's so beautiful. Oh, quest lines? Well, then I can't do that. <laughs> Good night, Arion! Thank you for hanging out with us. I hope you enjoyed your time and thank you for, you know, for being here with us. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I hope you have a good night. Sleep well. Sleep well. Um, there it is, the Twelve Wanderers. Hermes is looking for Doris. Let's look for Doris too. He's a man with long blonde hair, I think. All, I'll, I'll know him when I see him. Mithian is now accompanying you. Hog. Uh, I'll get the, I got the etherite first. First things first, I get the etherite. <laughs> Oh my god, the RPers are the RPers are out here. Let's see. Any interactions? I don't know. Once I get back and record today's results, should finally be able to put that report to it. This is not yeah, this is not this is not the person, but I think I have to I have to interact with them. It's not it either. Huh, if you're with Meteon, I assume you're on an errand for Hermes. What can I do for you? S sorry, wrong person. We're looking for Doris. I see. We do have similar hair, so people often mistake us from afar. Hope you find him soon. I don't know if I have to interact with him. 
I don't have to, okay. Well, I just wasted everyone's time. <laughs> it's okay, it's fine. Ah, it's probably him. Doros, that's Doros. Well now, if it isn't Meteon, what brings you here? Oh my god, making so many sounds. <laughs> ah, I thought I heard familiar voices. I didn't realize you two had decided to help me search for doors. Thank you. You're in charge of the like, 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 I don't know how to say that. I believe. Uh, where are they now? Like, plural is a whole different issue. <laughs> uh. Out in the fields and restraints, frantzied as they were, I couldn't well return them to Catesis. Once I've submitted my report, I'll see them reverted without delay. It's as he says, the beast is indeed quite ferocious. You're one of the fourteen, what brings you here? Nothing you need concern yourself with, as you were. We've heard the news that the Lycon slaughtered Occupetes. Is as the observer in charge, are you you are of the opinion that they are not fit to be released? I I am. Their abnormal aggression and exceptional strength makes for a, makes for a highly problematic combination. It matters not where they are released, like Kaons, Kaonis. <laughs> what? See, okay, it's an L. Yeah, I can see it now. Now, uh, like Kaons. Would threaten other species and upset the natural order. Could it be that the specimens observed uh, observed are an outliner? Highly unlikely. We've created a good many of them. All exhibited the same tendencies. Even when we used Kairos to begin with a fresh slate, their behavior was unchanged. Kairos? A memory reconfiguration system. The chief himself cre cre created it. It allows us to erase to or alter memories that we may observe creations in different env environmental conditions without needing to remake them from scratch. Quite impressive and potentially dangerous. Depending on the intensity of the etheric emissions, Pashtarot may wish to have words with you. Rest assured, I've kept all values within prescribed limits, and to prevent misuse, the, its applications are limited to those authorized by the chief overseer. Do not misunderstand. To manipulate a subject's memories is an intrusive act I deeply har ab abhor, abhor, but it is still preferable to execution. Come now, chief. Let's not be so melodramatic. What was born of ether is simply being reduced to its original state. I know the distinctions concern you. I know the distinctions concern you, but we mustn't lose sight of the bigger picture. Making rational choices for the sake of a more prosperous star. If a creation cannot be poorly studied, even with the aid of Kairos, we remake it. If a creation is deemed a detrimental existence, we unmake it. This all for the greater good, and none question the necessity of such routine processes. Okay, this is super interesting. I understand these things, I do. I would never think to unleash a clear and undeniable threat into the, onto the world. Yet insignificant, though their individual lives may be next to all creation, it is all the Lycaonies ca ca have. Before we seal their fates, we owe it to these beings to exhaust all options, to ensure that nothing has been overlooked. Damn, you tell them! If you insist, let me provide you with a full report, and we may take it from here. Would it be possible for us to attend the discussion, that Emmet Seth may better carry out his duties? By all means. Pray show them to the meeting room. It's like icons, but starting with light, light, and... Lycons? Le it's fine. I'll never get to pronounce it right. Oh no, she's sad. It's not good. I wish they did some phonetics above some words. Or you could select them. That would actually be super nice. Yeah. yeah I don't know. To man, other beings are just things. To be used and controlled like magic. That's what Hermes told me once. Aww. 
Uh, have I attuned to this? Yes, I have, right? Yeah. Yes, I have. I think I'm actually good. I think I'm actually good for today. I don't know. Do I want to start this? I feel like this is gonna... I feel like this is gonna start another quest line, so I'm not gonna do that right now. I think I'm fine. Uh, I think this is where we can actually... Where we can actually call it a day. Uh, because I'm pretty sure the meeting is gonna throw us into another cutscene, and then there's some other stuff gonna, you know, that's gonna go on. Uh, so yeah. You just did, you said it right. Well, I will not continue to do so. Yeah, you better pet Meteon, you better do that. Um... But yeah. Uh, this is where we stop for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I... it was great. It was a great stream. Um... Did I hear Emmett? No, you didn't. No, shut up, Brett. This is a good place to stop. Okay, that's good. <laughs> that's good, that's good. Um, let's see. Does anyone want to guide the raid before I start looking for someone? Would anyone like to guide the raid and send us over to, uh... Wanderer? What the fuck? Go to bed! How dare you? How dare you still be here? Ooh, Ryuji's actually getting the raid. That does that mean I don't have to search? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Wander, are you supposed to go to sleep? What is this? What is this blasphemy, huh? How dare you defy me? How dare you defy my, uh... My, um, authority? Hmm? Oh, well, I mean... <laughs> you know that- you know that Kason is doing, uh... <laughs> I just checked. It's Kason. You know that. You know that. Uh, she's watching. She's watching. She's just watching random videos, right? I hope you're all aware. I, you guys probably know her. Let's see, let's do that. Let me do that. <laughs> what an interesting choice. Um, I place interest in Kason chats. No, no, you won't. No, because I have to stream Final Fantasy. No one. No normie Twitch watcher wants to see Final Fantasy. Um, I'm happy that I've done some emotional damage to you. <laughs> no. 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 I'm in the bed. Okay, so close your eyes. Just close out of Twitch. Swipe up. Close out. Close. Close out of Twitch. And, and, and put your lock screen on. And then you close your eyes. Okay, Wanderer? Okay. Um, let me just start the raid here, and then we're good. Uh, can I do that? Yes. This channel has follower, subscriber only chat. Well, guys, you know what to do. <laughs> you know what to do. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Uh, let's see. Uh, let me post the raid messages. You, you better post the raid messages, okay? I want to see everyone spamming those. Um, if you copy and paste the first one, I'll be, you know, you know the drill. It's gonna turn into this one. Uh, so yeah, feel free to, uh, use that once we're going over to Kason. Uh, I think a lot of people, like, if you're familiar with VTubers, you probably know Kason. Uh, she's prob- she's only watching, like, random videos, but yeah. Um, it's pretty chill. So yeah, uh, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Uh, it was a great stream. I shall, uh, post the screenshots, uh, if I remember in the Discord, uh, but I'm probably gonna post them on Twitter. Yeah, <laughs> Twitter is gonna be the place. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for all the support and uh, for hanging out with me. Uh, we're gonna continue uh, on Tuesday. Uh, I don't know what we're gonna be doing yet. Um, maybe main story quest, maybe something else we're gonna see, but yeah. Um, I hope you guys have a good evening, day, night, whatever time it is for you. And uh, stay hydrated, stay safe, and if you're going to bed, have a good night. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys. And again, thank you so much for your support. And um, yeah. All of that good stuff. We're gonna we're gonna suffer more uh, next week. <laughs> so yeah. Um, bye bye everyone.